actually rent. I mean, I meant like bring your laptop or some shit. Bring your like you know entire ass computer. Bring your uh, monitor. I, <laughs> so at least really have no. I can't. I have to deal with this. There's three people around me, and I can't move my computer. They tell them about D and D. I playing D and D. Yeah, they know. They know I'm doing D and D. They're just <laughs> yeah, fun. Are they nice people? All right, where the fuck? Are yeah, they're going? my family. So yeah, ain't no way. All right, welcome to Cox of Fate session fucking fifteen. Uh, what Where's happened? We... Um, we showed up in Ramblebrush. And then we basically got led by one of the their old like friends, like a guardsman of some kind. And then we got to an estate that was owned or like tended by <laughs> Tursk. And he showed up and he was like, I'll wear all of your rooms. You guys look pretty fucked up. Go in sleep. And then Drigus had a bit of a moment of like all this hopeless and shit. And then we all slept. Um, Toliko played on the piano. <clears throat> Half of the group had a conversation about like the piano and music and like Toliko's pass and that stuff. While Nick's character and uh, Drigus talked about being sad <laughs> by the fire and not eating food. Um, Eventually, Spark, you do a Spark, Korzu, and a third person. What was her name? <laughs> what was the lady's name? Do you guys remember her name? Okay. Come on, Glass, it's your favorite character. Oh, Wilma. Wilma. Yeah. Uh, and came in and was like, ah, yes, here, we wish to talk. And then we talked to them as a group for a bit. And then as I was happening, Toliko was like, let me call up my homie. And then called up his homie. And then the homie was like, yo, your homie's dead. And then it was like, where were you when Harambe was killed? It was that exact moment. Um, came back, said, uh, we, the man's dead. And then everyone got really sad. And then I was like, you guys should probably come back. And then we walked to park. A lot of park shit happened. We were all there. Okay. Uh, threw Dragus in a lake. Talked to a ghost tree. Um, went fishing. Messed with the axolotls. Eventually, Spark came back. Talked about getting a stand. Uh, gave Toliko a stand. Eventually, stand pending. We bought stuff from the shop. And that was kind of where it ended. <laughs> After Nick got their mount from a tree. Oh, yeah, that shit was trippy. Yeah. I think you should check Adele for uh, being high. She yeah. got that, uh, what's it called? She got that Ravenna Forest, uh, fucking, uh, weed. <laughs> she got, she got that elf weed. <laughs> she got that elf weed, uh, what were you guys doing with the shopkeepers? You guys remember? Uh, we were talking about just general things to buy, and then we bought the <laughs> Blabaraba, and... Was it two other things bag or of tricks. one other thing? Bag of, uh, bag of tricks. And then we convinced the shopkeeper uh, to you know, attune to the magical jade uh, statue to go and investigate the dragon's hoard's bag. Just that we presented the idea that we, we could give like an amount of profits to him if he opens the bag for us. And he agreed. And now we're walking back to the... Uh, Lake. Got it. So we'll enter with that scene. You guys walking back to the lake. Now let's fuck off with these and add these. <laughs> That's Durgus. Right, you guys are free to move. Uh, I don't really <laughs> care about Durgus. So I'm gonna let's go. Yeah. Movie all the way here. <laughs> he ain't gonna talk for a bit. Mm hmm. So Falnex speaks up. Uh, so who has the thing again? The dragon's horde. It's uh who? Which one? Which one of the party members? He's the tobacco. Uh, oh, my vision isn't that good. Can you show me? Oh, we're walking there anyway. Follow me.
Damn, I should give one of you guys control of Emily, so I don't have to <laughs> put me off scotch. You're sh you sure this would work? Like, do I have to do something specific? I don't know how it works, but if you can, like, stop time, then try to open it during stop time. Or just interact with it while you're using the time thing. What? However that works. What, hmm. what, what have you uh, found out about this bag? It, it has something to do with time, and it's a dragon horde bag. I don't know. Hmm. We don't know much. Um, I could always take a look at the bag, too. Sure. And you guys see uh, these weirdos, excluding Durkus. Just fuck off. Uh, what's Tolko doing? Anything you've been doing recently? Uh, well? I guess. What's swimming? Yeah, after you I see, went uh, swimming. Talon had, like, prevent a ship. I think Tolko's just kind of. He, he's just kind of uh, taking in things and he's just kind of like, like, okay, so the guy's dead, gone. He turned into a mount. And there's nothing, and the lake's pretty deep. Uh, well, we have a lot of mysteries, and their answers find. I agree, we have a lot of mysteries. Um, I forgot your name. My apologies. Mm. It's Phonic. Ah, uh, oh, it's you. Hey, hey, hello, Phonic. Better see you again. The name's uh, Tolko. Right, right, right. So, so I've been here because uh, your friends, I think they're your friends, I'm not too sure, sure, but your friends said I could have some of the problems if I open the dragon board back up and it has something to do with time. Uh, Toko will, like, he, he makes a very quick, like, glare at Giuseppe and then he, he focuses back to thing. Hey, uh, yes. Um, here, let me grab it. Uh, to Toko will, like, pull it out and, like, hand it, like, he's gonna, he's gonna, like, put it in front of him. Alright, so, uh, 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 I suppose so just accept the first and I think you know, I always check just to see if it's a specific spot of magic. Uh last time I checked it does have a pretty strong seal on it. Uh mm -hmm. divine in nature. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um you know, you know, live, 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 live. I should give it a try, I guess. I mean, the bag's on the ground, so. I thought the whole cat had it. But yeah, he probably had it. Yeah, he ain't done shit. Alright, I'm gonna, like, look, 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 with permission, uh, I want to uh, cast again. Cool. Uh, you get uh, basically the same thing that they the dragon board in that bag. Dragon board in that bag. It's basically a bag of gold, but it's locked up in a magic seal. seal. The seal being, uh, something to do, do with the time. I'm a magic dick. Mm -hmm. And that's how you really get it. It's essentially a bag of gold. Well, maybe like, like a bag of gold and bag of gold in box. Because you're not, not sure how big it is. It could be different, but it's, it's a lot of the seal, seal regardless. Time. What turn to like what it means by time though? Or like stopping time and you know, speeding up time or slowing down time and whatever? You're not sure. sure. Okay. It's very vague in the rest of the time. Does just just see real real time. Um, what type of time is it though? It's fine. What would it be? You can be just slowing down or just just acting. Um, I just feel like, like the the bag, bag isn't like, like really tasting or sort of lighter or, or smell or anything because it isn't like a lighter dimension. It's just plain. Okay. Has the the bag itself like degraded at all? Nope. Nope. 
big new magic, magic seems, seems to be unbreakable. unbreakable. Oh, yeah, I think it's being unstatic because it's the. Uh, it might not be the magic, but I would like to believe that. that. If it goes in the back or forward, it's just some more aware of where they're on. We could just try uh, pulling it really hard again. It may be a good way to do it. But... Uh, if the bag doesn't go forward and backwards, as you said, due to time. And so we can make the conclusion that maybe it's paused in time, and that's why we can't open it. And so <laughs> our goal would be to, I guess, resume time for it. Yeah, yeah. Moving forward. Uh, you guys, can you hear me? Yes. Yes. Yeah, yeah, um, okay. Uh, quick background. Um, I, was I was making dinner. dinner. I was trying to finish up before uh, uh, yeah, I was uh, And then, then I, I turned out dropping things and green, green, green crackers and then accidentally getting them in your eyes. It's very green, 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 there has to be some point for us to let them restart its time. Probably. Uh, uh, so I don't know. I this thing really hard. Is that uh, JJ's statue? I, I don't know what this, this is JJ's statue. Mm -hmm. It is a lifestyle, though, of course. Hmm. If if I may for the safety of your painting and all lives, I also have a gun of the statue. Persuasion is that correct? Okay, fine. Yeah, yeah. And he'll give me this to you. I'm not just Alright, uh... <laughs> <laughs> uh, so I'll send you one. Yup, yup. Uh, you beautiful. She, uh, beautiful, let's fix that. B A A beautiful. This is what you learn. Do you see of consequences? Like, 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 Yeah, it's, 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 it's
I don't, I don't know. know. It's I mean, bag. I don't believe a bag would be alive in most cases, but uh, probably if it can die, but. <laughs> I mean, into the yes, and I believe. Let's see. So, what it, you have to hold this thing for effects to happen? Okay, if that is the case, then uh, does the bag have like chains on it? Like, in, like, oh, like, is there a way we can kind of like fasten the statue to it? Yeah, I, I guess. There's not not chains, but like leather, like wraps and seals and stuff. Yeah, yeah. Is that? There's, there's like a knot. Um, there's a knot of leather, which yeah, seems might... to be like very, you know, you could break it easily, but. From you know the past experiences, hell no, you can't. Time, time stop mm. is forcing you not to break. I, I, I guess the question is the Jade Idol does require attunement, right? Yeah. Um. Okay. Yeah. The the one the one thing we could try just to see if it works is we could tie the the idol to the bag and just see if something happens. Uh. Yeah. That would be a good. Idea. At least it's worth trying. I haven't tried yeah, something like that, but right yeah. Oh, uh, yeah, can someone catch me up on, like, what's going on here? Because it seems like we're trying to mess with some jade magic. How would basically, you go basically, I'm finishing we, cooking dinner, okay? We we walked back, and Falnik is investigating the bag. And we know the bag is in stop time, right? It's permanently stopped. So we're trying to figure out a way to make it not be permanently stopped. Okay. Yes, I don't know. If you allow, we could just use some twine and tie it to the bag. Don't, don't steal this. I am going to trust you, you know. Stranger that I keep forgetting the name of. And he'll give you the uh, idol. Okay, I will tie yeah. it to the bag. I'll, I'll pull out like some twine if he doesn't have it to let him do it. Now, so I'm looking at the description. Uh, the beautiful lady pour water over herself. If we take the water from this lake and, and you pour it, use it, use the idol to pour it onto the bag. Hmm. <laughs> you know, go for it, but like, yeah, go for it. That's all I can say. Maybe we make magical water. You make bath water? Ain't no way. Dear God, no. That's what you're literally doing. So you guys tie the uh, twine, the idol, and the bag together. And... Are you doing anything with it? Uh, I'm just gonna make sure, like, the idol is touching the bag, so. Anything else? Uh, it doesn't seem to be doing anything. Hmm. Well, in normal cases, it takes about an hour to get acquainted with a magical item. So either we can wait that, or we can just try some other ideas while it's happening. I, I do I do want to consider your idea, Giuseppe. I am just worried about that being considered puncturing the bag. Um, if we want to attempt to use our strength to rip the seal off, I don't know how well that would go. Magic usually does not like brutality in a heavy sense. Maybe we can try opening it while we're both holding the idol. Maybe Able that'll work. I don't know. I I guess another thing as well is um it uh, if if the holder is immune to time magical effects, is everything you are holding immune to Phone, like, just like hold the bag and try to open it, I guess, while you're holding the idol. Please say that again. You so seem I'm, to cut off yourself. I'm I'm considering the fact that you become immune to time-based magics when you hold the 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 jade, right? The idol. Maybe your yes. items do too. Uh, hold the bag. Hold the bag. Yes, hold the bag with the jade idol and see if you can undo its its uh its lock. 
keep it. All right. Uh, let's roll. He uh, he can't seem to untie it. Hmm. If all those spells, we could just try the Giuseppe method. Hmm. Yeah, no, let's do it. No skin on my bones. It's not my bag. <laughs> okay, so can I... Uh, well, I... Hmm. Can I have Falnik, like, grab one side and I try to grab the other and we just, like, pull it apart? We have oh, Falnik yeah, sure. hold the bag and then we just try to pull the Rip bag. it apart. Yeah, can I, I roll... Yeah, uh, can I roll the athletics for that? Yeah, anyone participating will roll athletics. Okay. Anyone participating? Well, can multiple, like everyone? Yeah, everyone can if they want to. Okay. Is there, is, I was, I want to ask, would there be any, like, arcana check I can make to see if, like, that's an actual reasonable solution without damaging what's inside? Like, in, uh, <laughs> you can, but it's going to be really fucking high. <laughs> All right, it's okay. Watch this. Fuck. No, can't really cool. tell. Alright. I'm still down with the plan. If ever if if like Toloko is is RA and like Nick is fine with it, you know, I I'll 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 help too. I'll roll. Hey, can I waste <laughs> my inspiration on this? Oh yeah, go race your inspiration <laughs> opening a bag. <laughs> You're trying to brute force it. <laughs> trying to brute force the bag. It's so funny. <laughs> the fuck is going on? They're opening a bag. Opening opening oh, the dragon no. sword bag or trying to. Okay, oh, can God. I redeem my inspiration that you were gonna give me, but I couldn't because I already had inspiration? Can I redeem that inspiration? No, you only have Matt, one. Seriously, calm down Dang. with the inspiration. Okay, oh, I'm zero one. inspiration now. Right, right. Don't worry, don't worry, Emily will help you. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit. Why is she beefy? I will, like, help as well and roll, but if I feel that the bag's, like, fucking gripping, I'm just gonna be like, okay, no, this is bad. Here we go. Alright, so let me count the total. Where the fuck are you guys? Do you want me to help too? Yeah, sure. Yeah, you're, in a, you're in a scene as well. I'm gonna say Tolko helps as well, but he's kinda, like, piss poor fuck. athletics. Never mind. Never mind. Uh, so that's a good roll, though. Mmm... Uh, Buttercup makes a roll too. <laughs> no, you don't know and how. how. Mother, I'm kidding, not, I'm kidding. Motherfucker, motherfucker uses this, antlers. Shut up. This motherfucker does not have opposable thumbs. <laughs> you guys pull and it doesn't seem like the bag is even budging a bit. Anyone can make a perception check though. If you're interested in perceptioning. Yeah, I'm good the at bag these. Itself, if you're looking at it. Another, another 20. Alright. Uh, all three of you guys, you can, I guess, tell that... Now, V's hypothesis is right, that it is kind of stopped in time. Mm. There's, it doesn't seem like there's any tension, like, within it. Aside from, like, the strings on the sides, there isn't, there isn't really any tension, like, on the, uh... I guess what's called... The wrappings around it, what's called opening of the bag. I tell you what's wrong with it. It ain't got no gas in it. So it's it's as if like um, it's our frozen. our force also becomes neutral when we try. Yes. Okay. Um. Fuck physics. <laughs> I. The only other option I suppose I have, without delving into that timey wimey bullshit, um, is just an attempt of dispel, but that'll take me bit more time as I would need to go and study and learn the knowledge again as I've forgotten. Um or you know we could wait like uh eleven one, months. Eleven months, yeah. <laughs> Listen, I'll, I'll keep what? I'll get you a deal. Let's... I won't sell this item for any mm. to anyone else. Unless mm. you guys want to buy it like right away, but I'll save this item so the next time we meet in the future, probably, you know, in 11 months, maybe we can try, you know, the whole time stopping thing. Yeah, yeah, sure. Let's let's go with whatever comes first. Um, the 11th month or my ability to dispel. 
Seems like a reasonable deal. Mm -hmm. In 11 months, I'm probably going to be strong enough to break things and stop time. But, you know, whatever comes first. Whatever comes first, but I would still like to have some of that, you know, that money. <laughs> we did all these things, you know. We, we solved this uh, puzzle together, right? So... Just, you know, just a bit. That's a treat. Man, your, guy, your silences are, uh... I'm feeling uncomfortable here. No, I, I do apologize. I was doing some reading. I'm figuring out if I had the spell. Uh, <laughs> I uh, wrong. Oof. Uh, can, you, can I get like a brief catch up of what we found out? So, wait, the bag stuck in time. We was... right, bag stuck in time. Any force that's like being applied to it is kind of like you know, dispel, displaced because yeah, you can't move shit and stop time, <laughs> or at least this bag rather. Mm, okay. So the hypothesis is like either strong mage breaks it with the spell magic, hard, or you can uh, what's it called, wait eleven months. I follow Nick if what's called the Jade Isle, he won't sell it anymore. But save it for you guys and see if what's called. In 11 months, if he stops time with the uh, idol, he'll break the uh, seal. Well, if uh, <laughs> this thing is stuck in time, then <laughs> nothing affects it. You can use it as a wall, basically, right? <laughs> as a what? A wall? Oh. As a wall. <laughs> nothing like... gets through it, right? <laughs> I. Yeah. Dude, but... he, is dying. he needs wall time. <laughs> Yeah, that's Dil really weird. Dil I'm fucking dying out of character. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Jesus. First, first the fucking mean. onions in your eyes, and now this guy. What the hell? So it can use it as a bulletproof vest, basically, as a specific part of your body. If you're willing I'm to carry it for cool. that, I guess. For the record, though, the bag is not that big, so. Yeah, Still. If you're trying that, I won't give you ace. Whoa, idiot, have you ever shot a rocket launcher out of the air? <laughs> Mr. John Yakuza has. Take that. Listen, Except you built different, you'd get lucky. Simple. You haven't pulled that shit in Valve, it's ain't no way. Wait, so if <laughs> Someone shot your drone. If it neutralizes forces, the forces are within it. You know those, like, levitating sticks that, that the shopkeeper was showing us? We could pretend. Do you think we could uh, remove the effect of it if we didn't need the bag? Maybe. Maybe it's only the force within the bag, not the outside of it. You know, mm, it's maybe. not. It's not stuck in animation in the air or wherever that that term is. Like those rods, they just stick it over there. <clears throat> oh, you're talking about movable rods. Mm -hmm. I don't think it's like that, that, but like, you can't really damage the bag. Have you even tried cutting it? Uh, no, but I can try real quick. Uh, Torko will I'll swipe at the bag with his claws. Wait, will, okay. Wait, no. Will that spill out into the astral plane if we do that? If it breaks? I, 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 I brought that up. <laughs> I, I brought that up and I'm like, don't, please. Slash Jedi, I'd rather not it's test our theory. You know, Polico is built different. I'll let him do it. I don't care. Please don't. Are you still slashing it? Uh, yes, with my claws. All right, okay. uh, nothing happens. He scratched a bag. No, do I feel any, like, resistance or anything when I was doing it? Are there any markings? Uh, any markings on the bag? Perception. Okay. Fuck. Jewish. Jewelers fucking eyes at this point. <clears throat> There's some, but it quickly fades away. Oh, interesting. It. How does it oh, fade? So... How does it fade? As if it's being undone. Yeah, so it's it's going it's going from bottom to top. It's it's being reversed. Okay. Oh, it's going back to the future. Holy shit! <clears throat> it's undoing it. So that means. If it's undoing it. Ah, okay, let's try this then. Uh, Toko is then going to uh, do, I think, 10 swipes in quick succession. Oh. Yeah, so roll, bad. I guess, 10 attacks then. Okay. Uh, uh, eh, never mind. So I could give him Bardic Inspiration, but that probably won't matter much if it's 10 separate rolls. Why? 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 It would be really wild. Wait, what do you think's gonna happen? 
It'd be really wild if Giuseppe would bring up the idea of chainsaws. <laughs> wow. How <laughs> <laughs> he know? Wait, it's like his cameras. I wanted to talk to the guy yeah. about that, but he wasn't there. Each swipe you deal, it was the, what's called quote unquote regeneration. It's not really that, but I'm gonna call it that. The regeneration of the uh, bag gets faster. At least that's what you think. But hmm. yeah, there is what's called. In the end, there hasn't been any progress done. You didn't open the bag. Oh, it's well, still locked, cool. sealed, and brown, like me. So huh. it doesn't speed up the more it gets damaged? That's what it seems like. Okay, so keep damaging and see what happens. Okay, uh, Toko's gonna I'll, I'll just blast nah, it. I'd, 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 rather not, I'd rather not just waste our energy. <laughs> nah, it's not really wasting my energy. Uh, point Blake and Eld Blast. <laughs> Actually, uh, roll, roll, roll for disadvantage, please. You're out. It's Point Blake. Actually, <laughs> yeah. Uh, so I assume the bag isn't alive. Could I test if it's alive by Marshall checking myself and then trying to shoot it with psychic damage? You can't do that. Um, all right, uh, then I'll, I'll then I'll answer this question. Um, when I identified it, was it considered a creature? Comma, did I know the spell affecting it, or was it considered an object? Object. <laughs> it's an object. And also, Matthew, you kind of asked that question in college a long time ago. What? No, this was specifically to test if it was a creature. But yeah, I can Marshall check myself. I'm built different. I can do that. Uh, it's called filling yourself, but I... Okay, so let's see. The bag reverses damage done to it. And then we know the Silent Knight's axe will do critical damage to it. Because <laughs> it's... <laughs> oh, right, you've met him. That's weird. We do thunder damage on this thing. I... Do you think the knight could open this with his axe? Is that what we want to do? Do you, do you oh. want to talk to that knight and okay. ask him to open We, we can fake him bag. out. Ask, ask him to attack a bag. We yeah. can, what we could do is we could um, strap the bag to Durgus's chest when we next encounter him. I... No! <laughs> You're gonna kill Durgus? No. Well, I, I, love, mean, I love my character getting killed off as soon as I have a minor medic. I'm not. I'm. I'm not saying. I. I would not want the the death of Durgus to happen from a constitute of wanting to open a bag. That is by far the definition of curiosity killed the Drake. I mean, <laughs> all right, Drakes. I mean, I don't want to say, like, just walk up and ask him, that's fully, that's what he did to us? No, 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 it's more so, like, make combat. Like, we, I guess, you, he swings at us, we hit him, and we put that in front of him, win the sword and the blade. Yeah. See what happens. If only we had, like, some sort of, like, sticky substance and put it on top of, like, a shield or something. <laughs> Tears of the Kingdom. Uh, <laughs> I'd like to make a history check. Does glue exist? I'm pretty sure glue eaters exist, but I'm not sure glue itself exists. We don't have yeah. horses. We, we, we no, have, we have, you can we have make glue than other than horses. <laughs> yeah. Let's go with the idea. Yeah, I'm, I'm going. I'm going. With, if, if it's like a, a sap glue or something, but it does There's not matter. Like, no, I think I'm pretty sure glue exists. I think because I made mm. tape exist, so I'm pretty sure yeah. glue also exists. So glue has sure. to exist. It's probably sap glue, not like you know the glue we have right now. Mm -hmm. Probably, probably some sort of like slime ooze type of shit going on. Made from Google. Made from Kirby. That won't make sense. Nobody can do and he's like, well, <laughs> so is that our uh, is that our current best bet? Is having to get attacked by a person who seems to be in tuned with that stuff? Or it can, you know, just <laughs> eleven months. I'm. I'm oh, wait. Sure. Or, we, or we could just wait eleven months. I mean, we could yeah. try both. Why not both? Yeah. Just be careful because I heard is uh, not to make any sexual innuendos. I heard his uh, sword was really big and long. Uh, yes, yes, it is. Uh, it's a very it a... dangerous weapon. And girthy was, as well. Wasn't it an axe? Uh, it was a, uh, yeah, it, it was. It was a, yeah, it was a. It was a like a glaive uh, almost. It looked you, odd. Did you know him having a sword? That's what it was described to me, at least in the paper. Ah, uh, uh, well. But no, 
Oh, as Weird. someone who's taken a few swipes from it, no, that's not that's not a sword. It's not. But it's what not if it could become a sword? I mean, what if? How would you ask him? <laughs> Maybe you can you know, be friend of him. Well, attack the rest of us. Uh, <laughs> no fucking reason to. Yeah, I could try befriending him. Whatever that weapon is, it's like a technological marvel if you do that. Hmm. If you want those, go to Ugold. <laughs> There's some places too. Some uh, some funny places. <laughs> what what kind of funny places? Uh, it's an organ. There's a place that makes weapons or experiments with those, rather. Not really public, but if you find one, you can kind of raid it if you want to be a criminal. Do I know what he's talking about? Uh, not really. Okay. But what what are these facilities? Are they like who who controls? Think them? of it like testing grounds, right? I don't really know myself. I just hear of it. Hmm. Who'd you hear it from? Oh, my boss. Who's your boss? Your boss? Oh, Alexander King. Wait, oh, I, you're talking I, about uh, the, the actual king? Uh, Here? Mr. No, Wait, right. isn't that Marathon guy? Do I, do I know who Alexander King is being... Uh... Hard Oak people know who Alexander King is. No. And for, for Hard Oak people, you know that Alexander King is basically the crime boss of the underbelly of uh, Ugal. Not the actual, you know, fucking leader of Ugal, but the crime boss. Thunderbelly yeah. is pretty what's called big for that place, so do do keep that in mind. Yeah, I, I think I know a guy that works for him actually, Alexander King. Oh yeah, you know me. Well, someone else. Oh. But I know two people that work for him. Cool. That's all right, pal, Nick. You you always be second choice in Giuseppe's eyes. I didn't say. I, that. I don't mind. <laughs> It was. I thought it was implied, Mr. but if you didn't, if that's not, I'm happy. Mr. King is an interesting character, though. It's only from hearing about him, never actually having a run-in with him. Run-in with his men, though. Interesting time. That's kind of common. I mean, I'm right here, right? So. Mm hmm. One of them really wanted to stab me. Oh, that's I, normal. I I kind of. Uh, <laughs> beat their skull in, but also um, normal. Yes. Do you know a guy named Stokes? I ask him. I don't know who that is. Okay, S O A Q S is how it's spelled. To what be fair, do? I do forget names quite a bit, so I don't recognize him. Does he have a description, like you know, face? Yes, he <laughs> does. Wait for me to check what I wrote down. Hold on, hold on. Giuseppe checks out. Checks out so <laughs> yeah, much. hold on. Shouldn't there be yeah, a lot he's... of faces of people? <laughs> yeah, he, you know, he had like Giuseppe. a brown, he had like a dark brown pompadour. Uh, he's a human. Out like a picture book. He <laughs> shows it to the class. A bright brown pompadour. You know, yeah, if... A dark brown pompadour. You know, Should hazel we... eyes, I think. Even if he's a human. That's all I remember, really. All right, human... That's literally everyone, like even, even, yeah, but <laughs> brown, bright brown popular is the most I can go with, and I, I haven't really seen any person like that, so if I met him, then I would have known him. Hmm, okay. Also wearing a pompadour? How does that look? I thought that was out of style. Oh, it's kind of like floppy, you can like flick it. <laughs> it's kind of funny. I think. Wait, it was a style before? It was? <laughs> Kinda looks at Naveed. Certain time. Yeah. Huh. Um, a lot of... young kids think they could get to the level of Mr. King. And some of them took that style. I'm not sure if boss had that haircut as well, but okay. <laughs> oh, that's good. It's shit. I'd be surprised if he had one. No offense to your friend, Giuseppe. Uh, I mean, he's not really a friend. I just know him because I treated a bullet wound he had. Oh, he taught me, you. like, yeah. Can he taught me, like, he taught me what I know about, like, thieves can't and that kind of thing. Mm. He was in 
hospital one time. Then, then what I meant to say was full offense to your acquaintance. Um, eh. I mean, he was <laughs> nice enough, but I don't really know him that well. Hmm. Maybe we'll run into him again. Yeah. Uh, speaking of, uh, speaking, speaking of, uh, of uh, meeting people, we uh, should be on our way to go meet up with Chatticus. We could. Um, Who's that again? One of our companions. Which one? The uh, uh, the, the third no. white-haired person. <laughs> Why are so many white-haired people here? I don't know. Uh, the down now? Yeah, like the old man, kind of gruffy. Oh, the old man, him. but yet young. Wait, they're still dead now. How old was Jadakus? Uh, uh Telecom, help me, help me out here, help me out. And that's a good question. I know the one I know, <laughs> but I do not know the age of this one. I think he was, I think he's young, actually. I don't know what you mean by that, so I'm going to ignore what you're saying. <laughs> but for college, we should meet him. So let's keep moving. The lady did say she was getting our um, airship prepared. We have those. Um, maybe. If not, then we can still wait. I I can go. I can go check. Just... We we could all go. I think we're done here. That's You're missing a friend or. Oh, well, do you guys want to buy anything else first? You know, you, the, the whole party's here, right? You know, I, everything here is worth its price, so I uh, have these, you know, really delicious uh, things that make you jump up really high. I, mm, I, mm, I, I don't think we have a preference for sweets right now. No, no sweets. To, uh, I, I don't got a sweet tooth, really. Nah, I like in the blob <laughs> the, the funny stick. I think, I'm, blob, I'm in... I think that's... Oh yeah, blob means meets funny stick in uh, my language. Oh, well, I'm glad. Um, I'm happy to try it out when we get into the next combo. Be careful, though. It can, uh, it can do some funny things. It can. It can. It'd be a shame if it goes against me, but I am only hoping that it is in our, both of our best interests and the staff's best interests that it um works in our benefit. Of course. I'll see. Like, you guys are really my only customers for some reason. Well, or rather, my first, rather, uh, my first current patrons um it'd you... probably help if you told if uh some of these things were kind of cursed but yeah whatever they are uh i don't think they were <laughs> what did you buy a cursed well, item the, well the the group gave me one on as a gift and now uh i'm hearing oh, some voices this is that it. one yeah my, my apologies i uh see alexander just gives me my price and I kind of go with that I mean, you know, up it a bit, you know, it's just I can get some for myself, but I don't really test out most of these items except for this idol, because I can't steal it. Where'd you steal it from? Uh, who got? Mm. Mm. Hops on the oak. But yeah, no, I, th I think we all are good on all of our payments right now. Um, we do appreciate the business. Um, as you say, of us being our <laughs> Your only customers, uh, may you pray for our benefit so we can put more coin in your pocket. Of course! Thank you again! Bring your so friend here as well. Stay safe, uh, I don't really have a name for you guys. I'm gonna call you, uh... Hmm. Yeah, I, I don't really know what fits. You don't even have a- you don't have, like, a group name, right? No, that, the Shovel Knight. Cheesy, cheesy. Oh, okay, Shovel Knight. No, Knights. we're not the Noble. We don't even have any shovels. I have a shovel. I equip my shovel. <laughs> yes, but the S implies multiple. We don't all have one. You guys one. can buy shovels easily. We're, we're With what we're, coin? We're called the family uh, We have some money. The family We one. have three gold. I said out of character, the family basket. Like the KFC family meal. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, do we only have three gold left? No, Do we have uh, 553. No, you guys got some shit from last session. Uh, Did we minus get 150 more? gold? Uh, da, 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 what no, else? we're out of. The measure for the bag. Uh, we it should it should be at uh 500. It's just 553 minus the 150. I'm remember sure what's called? I remember you guys saying as well like 
uh, Navi was bringing up, oh yeah, we don't want to spend all our gold right now. Yeah, which is so, a new thing, so... Because yeah, we, I don't because think we it's had... I think it's 553. Yeah, I, yeah, it is 553 because we had eight, like 1800 for getting paid from this job, and we did not spend that 1800. Okay. Right, so, so I'm going to just go with the 553. Or you yourself eventually edited it. No, I have it on my sheet. Yeah. Are you guys heading back to the main square? Yes. Yes. Got it. Now I'm gonna move you guys. What the fuck am I missing? I have everyone here and. I hope our thing's okay. It's probably on a no. I don't know what he's on. I'm missing someone. Someone activate the scene. Tell me who I'm missing. I'm missing what's called. What's your name again? Bitch lady. Wilma? No, Emily. Wait, no, she's here. Fuck. Wait, don't You're call missing a bitch. character. What am I missing? No, the link is not here. You're missing Toloko. Oh shit! I hate him. Oh shit! Oh, uh, you guys make it back here. Oh shit! These guys aren't really doing shit. Uh, fuck! I forgot to bring an NPC inside. Give me a moment. Uh, there we go. Yep. Maps open. I buy uh ink. Okay. Paint. Ink. Yeah, so I can cast whatever the, that spell, illusionary script. Ink. Illusionary ink for script. that. How much does that cost? Um, I just, five I, gold I, of ink. How much was it? Oh, see, let's hold on to that. Just ask someone for ink. <laughs> ask someone you know. They'll probably give it to you. But it needs to be like ink that specifically costs a certain amount, doesn't it? I'm not too sure. But as I said before, most of the shops are closed at the moment, considering they're helping out with the, you know, a bunch of fucking, you know, Mercusius people showed up, so let's deal with that helping, first. Helping out with the war efforts? Not all war, but yeah, the war the war, The war efforts? War the the war, the war, war. Anyway, uh, I'm back at my computer. Everything seems to be good now. I Welcome miss back. you. Thanks. Yeah, I need to buy a lead-based ink that costs 10 gold. What? Wait, what? Oh, well, okay, how many children are we going to harm hey, with this? Hey, guys. Uh, a lot. Fun fact. A bottle of ink costs 10 gold. Hey, okay. lead-based ones, actually. Yeah, that's very specific. So, good yeah, luck. Hey. You know, okay. we're just going to put some lead pipes into it. You happy with that, Giuseppe? You're happy. Just make some lead. Hey, Giuseppe, Go. as a doctor, you should object to this. Eat the lead. I'm nah. Open, but the cutscene will be happening soon. Also, Kirby, let me cheat. I don't want to actually have to buy what? ink. Yeah. Probably ink like sooner or later. You, uh, I, 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 Matt, you can cheat and not buy ink, but you'll it'll cost you a point of inspiration. Yeah. <laughs> God, that's gonna haunt you for the rest of the campaign, isn't it? I, I, I have the the lead based ink bottle. <laughs> I, I I actually do. It's part of my loot. It's an ink. I have an ink bottle. I'm gonna say that. Anyways, was guys. Uh... Anyways, uh, go hey guys. Yeah, cutscene. Uh... Yeah, I'm so open, but he's like looking at you, waiting. Okay. Uh, What's going on to us? Oh yeah, you don't know who he is. Oh, uh, that's uh, that's catch. Twenty two. No, no, no. I don't know if there's 22 of them, but <laughs> there's saying, one. Are you saying that out loud? He just makes balls. Wait, wait, are we still in Ramble Bush? Yeah, yeah. Move. Yeah. Hmm. But, but, no, but um, yeah, that's Cash. Uh, that, that's, he's going to be helping us out uh, uh, on our. Uh, on our I'm, not, I'm not seeing Catch. A companion of yours. Okay. Refresh, Darius. Refresh. That's why I, I was like, wait, am I bored? Um, okay. That's good enough for me if he's a companion of yours. Oh yeah, uh it also uh this is Buttercup right here. This is part of the spear from earlier. The the man? No, this Well Just yes patting the fucking the, oak. The spirit. The spirit was the was the man. Wait, did he yeah. die? Did he get eaten? Bye bye well, bye Buttercup. I, I, I didn't know Elves gonna <laughs> eat people. <laughs> <laughs> you you never even knew. But no, uh the the man I helped me out with my spell. There we go, yeah. there's catch. The man helped me out with the spell and is now. Oh, huh. that's interesting to hear. Maybe it is better for someone 
tra traveled instead of being stagnant by a tree. Yeah, after I was talking with him, he did say he was stuck. So. Mm. Change of change of seasonary at least. Fair enough. <clears throat> May I pet Buttercup? Go ahead. I will put my hand up to the the weird deer thing and it attempt to pet react. it to see if it accepts. It doesn't react, right, but it's a I, it's a giant elk. Yeah, I, I pet I pet the elk. Yeah. Mystical. Indeed. That's what I try to go for. Pissed off with the stories, but yeah. Mm. As I said. Anyways, it's looks really back over the catch. Catch is like uh, tapping his foot. It's like uh, <laughs> trying to make make sure trying to like wait for you guys, but at the same time, like you know, kind of want to tell you guys something. Okay, yeah, we should like, probably go. Points at the elk and like ask Del, is this possible? Um, is this elk possible? I don't understand the question. Keep moving, please. Elks are possible to have. <laughs> elks what is are possible in reality, Giuseppe. Okay, never mind. I won't. I won't try. Then. Never mind. <clears throat> what? What does that mean? <laughs> Um, catch. So, hey, oh, uh, oh, howdy, y'all. You guys, uh, I didn't want to rush y'all. Yeah, but, uh, we're, we, yeah. Airship's ready. Oh, okay. That's good. Thank you. you just, uh, if you want, just talk to me and I'll lead you. I'll lead y'all to the way to the airship. Cloud Gaza. Do I have a grimoire ready for them yet, Kirby? Or. Man, you didn't have a campaign yet last week, so no. <laughs> you didn't do oh. shit. So, Not as much uh, time has passed. Yeah, if I blame Kirby. If y'all have any, uh, I guess you know things you want to do here first, just you know, I want to do them first. Gonna relax here uh, next to a this kind of abandoned place. I don't know where he went, but maybe you'll see him soon. No. No. Yeah, yes, I whoever that ago. was. <laughs> if you all are ready. I've got nothing yeah, better to do. Should we go say bye to the to the people we, we just rescued? Suppose. Oh, we could always say goodbye to him. He was a valuable ally. I like him. Blush. I like him too. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta make a second one now, Kirby. Good job. I should put... Oh yeah, he's there. Alright. You guys saying bye to him? Yeah, we're gonna go walk around, see how the people are doing that got through the portal, and we're gonna go say goodbye to him. Oh well, yeah, how's him? How's him doing? Well, let's we're go check. Find out. It's kind of funny, like the Mercusius is like the pre the people from Mercusius, right? Like they're kind of like sad, upset, you know, when they first got here, but they've quickly, I guess, changed the mood, right? They've become a lot more happy and jovial. Which I guess could also explain, you know, how Mercusi survived two fucking attacks before him. They're just happy-natured people. Happy-natured people. Mm -hmm. Oh wait, actually, can I restock on the holy water? Uh, there's no one watching, so go for it. Okay, well, you're allowed wait. to, you're allowed to. Wait, what do you mean there's no this one isn't watching? This a crime, is it? Originally, <laughs> what's called, there was a person here who was like saying, oh yeah, you know, three, you know, per person. Like three holy water bottles for per person, right? But okay, well, hold on. If Sorry. you want to have bad karma, go for it. Wait. Bad karma and Korzu on your ass like, later was on. That, <laughs> was that three in your entire life, or just you can only take three at once? How's this you're work? Not, you're not sure. Oh, okay. Wait, okay, well, I maybe think... <laughs> no one's here. Oh, well, I could have. <laughs> Someone's okay. technically here. <laughs> I walked up to phone. Hey, oh, are, are you happy? Hey, are you allowed to take like more than three? I don't really hang around near the fountain. I'm not sure. I just know three of it, but I'm not sure if it's like can you refill it later on, or you know, do you have to wait a certain time period? I don't know. Okay. <laughs> well, I I used one, so I'll just refill the one that I used. I so... don't know which goddess is even for, so I guess it's a good thing. Go for it. Okay. Yeah, I refill, so I have three in total now. There you go. We can edit your sheet. Okay. Thank it, you. Uh, it's a shrine to Spark. You've now made Spark angry. No, it's um, not. 
<laughs> He's coming for your ass. No, 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 no. Yeah. Oh, come. Spark first doing? out of the library. Who's taking my water? <laughs> there we go. Doing, yeah, oh, Holy shit, Spark is Nestle, the company. This, oh, it's, it's Nestle. Oh, it's no. Nestle. <laughs> no, that means he has indigenous servants, too. It's, actual oh, no, base, child workers. Base. Let's keep that. Let's keep that. No. Are you guys anything? Or just saying, let's not turn now this place. We're, we're... We're about I'm to answer the floor, but I'm curious about why is Josephy looking at the fountain and then the knowledge that it's holy water is just like eyes wide, like what the fuck? Uh, yeah, some sort of communal holy water or something. They have it out. Something in that Kozu had some some something something. It's a gift from the old world. It's a gift from the world arc old old archivist, <laughs> but uh, you guys don't know that. Are we are we allowed to take holy water? We might. I don't know what we could run in, but holy water is always good to have. You can take up to three. <laughs> Why'd you say it like that? Like, per, is there? A I don't, per I don't know. I'd just, be. Just I, I don't three? know, Dell. Why would I be annoyed at this, someone who chucked me into a lake without warning? Ah, uh, good point. Like, uh, is the whole three things here. Is is it just three? That's what enough. we're told. Huh. Cool. I suppose I'll take it on our way back. Honestly, I kind of forgot you were, you were thrown into the water. <laughs> Where am I? <laughs> Evelyn goes Thanks. blind. Thanks, Del. You're a true friend. Alright, for now, I'm going to beat your ass later. <laughs> Cause I'm a fucking elk. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I got, I got lost again. My my my, my y'all. Here, hold I my think, hand. I think it would be okay if you do not attempt to insinuate a fight in, in public. I think I'm ready not, for that. Not even if it isn't public. It might be best not. To Are you saying fight. behind closed doors? We could do that. <laughs> Oh, I'm saying that both in public and behind closed doors. I would my, my dad to... told me all about, you know, handholding. Because we're oh. supposed to be a team, and I wouldn't want to beat up my party members. Really, no. I'm <laughs> sorry that you cannot up. understand the metaphor <laughs> of a lake. Oh, I like lakes. There's one I live nice. nearby. Oh, no, that was more of a river. But there was a lake though, and it was really cold. I almost drowned hmm. there, but thankfully I didn't. It is good that you're here today. Anyways, to the bar. So can I like walk back up to the party or not? Yeah, you can. Go okay. Get your ass over here. Uh that was me. That's you opening. That was it. That was that was the buttercup. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You guys open the door and you know, oh, coincidentally, the uh, more influential people of the heart of are here. You see him, and you see what's called the uh, platinum caps, and you see the brothers. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! There's two of them. <laughs> Hello, Mr. Him, platinum caps. Hello. They read not to you all respectfully. Um, is everyone all right? right to take this or say that again? All right. Me or Nick? Uh, you, uh, you go. I, I I I looked at like the party and I just said like, would one of you want to take this? To take over. I don't want to say. And then Nick said things. I don't, I don't know. I'm asking if they're all right. <laughs> I mean, I I thought Joel was just gonna start walking up to him. Hello. I'm alright. Uh, um, did you take a, like, I, I know you're alright, but like, the, um, how are you holding up, essentially? I am fine. Just filled with revenge. Oh, I am too. We're like two peas in the pod. Oh my gosh. And then we can... Then, I guess, seek your revenge and see it through. I shall. 
the rest of you stay safe. Thank you again. We will do our best. We will try. It's good to see you recovering. I am stronger yes. than I look. Hmm? Well, certainly. <laughs> I will not. I will not doubt that for a second. I don't doubt that. We just we saw you in action. Yep. The next time we encounter man, we'll give him a good punch just for you. I pat him on the back. I appreciate it. Uh, question. Uh, are the kids in the, in any of these chairs next to Tanya and them? I'll just say yeah because okay. of course. Because it'll, 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 like really, so, yeah. it'll be really it'll be really funny if I just like kicked one of them off and he got in the chair. <laughs> Sat on one of them because he didn't see it. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking thwomp. <laughs> you just pick up the child and just hold him throughout the entire conversation. Wait, 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 wait we have it, we have it. Hold on, where is it, where is it? Okay. Let, me, let me find him. We have the, uh... <laughs> no, we have a child saucer. No. <laughs> R.I.P. R.I.P. Rest in pieces. <laughs> I can't believe you gave that to the silent knight and to fucking fuzzy at the same time. Well, I mean, next time we need the silent knight, they'll have uh, another ability called Orphan Smasher. <laughs> orphan <laughs> Smasher. I mean, it's not really Orphan <laughs> Smasher, it's Orphan Creator at this rate. <laughs> Holy shit, there's a crater full of them? Oh no. Oh no. Uh, but Toko okay. right. will uh, walk up to, like, actually, oh, let's just Bro. Uh, let's just say he walks up to Ergoth. Ergoth? Yeah. Um, <clears throat> hello, Ergoth. How, how are you guys holding up? I mean, oh, we're doing just fine. Just, well, mourning the deaths of some of our comrades. Understandable. Just gives Toya some time. She's taking it the hardest out of all of us. I see. If you have business, you can always talk to me, though. Um, I don't think I have business, but I think I can try and give Tanya a gift, if you could. A gift? Yes. Uh, let's see. Toko is... <laughs> Toko's gonna use Shape Wire to try and create a rose. Cheating on your wife, damn! Two-time king over here. <laughs> Base Toliko. You make a uh, what are you making? A a rose. An ice rose? Or yeah. Anything special with it, or just? You know? Nope, it's just a normal ice rose. It, like if someone drops it, it will shatter, and nothing's gonna happen. It's just a normal rose. Is it gonna melt in someone's hand? Mm, if it's well made, well made enough, probably not. Holy shit, Toliko! Okay, if you want to make an if, like, unrequited love. if you want to try that, then go for it. Go run our economy. So let's see, like, how long this shit will last. <laughs> okay. That's okay, right. Make a rose, and you can definitely feel by the craftsmanship and obviously the magic you imbued into it that, yeah, this shit's not breaking unless someone you know smashes a hammer into it. It's not gonna melt. Uh, get this to Toya, uh, Toya, Toya, if you can. Ah, a rose. Are you trying to? No, I don't think it's she's my okay. it's my token appreciation. I'll let her know that. Hmm. You have our thanks, uh, Tolko, and, and the rest of your friends as well. Anytime. We. Um, oh, you go. We'll, we will be leaving to handle other business. Um, I don't want. I don't know if you it is if you think it is better for us to say our goodbyes to Toya, or if you want to give them to her when she's ready, uh, in time. In in time, I mm. no. I've never really seen Toya like this before, so mm. I am worried as well. Okay. Thank you, though. I will be leaving with them. Um, I assume it is whatever for you. Uh, give Toya my thanks. It's good. She gave me a lot of work. Thank you for your time, David. <laughs> Come visit us, of course. <laughs> I will do my best to remember. <laughs> oh, wow, you're a part of the Phantom Cavs. You can tell Dark, if you congrats. If you're first fucking uh, player in an organization. <clears throat> what are you doing, Dergus? 
Mm. <laughs> he doesn't really have a connection with a Bartman camp member, so he, he might just brood silently in the corner. You just have Ergo Ergods, which is shaky at best. <laughs> I, I, I think like the one interaction I had with Ergods was I took a necklace of firewalls. He's like, dude, just tell us if you're going to steal something from us. Damn, you already forgot the other one, or it's like, you know, you're being ass to him. Oh, right, yeah! But I was deliberately annoying him because he blew our cover. Dude, side chap, way to go. <laughs> <laughs> I get it. I'm not wrong! Yeah, you're brooding. The, 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 qu uh, class, the question is, does Toloko have an open relationship? Ooh. No. You know, I actually, so you really see, it's funny, I, uh, like, listen, at the beginning of this campaign, I actually rolled to see if she was, a, was open to that, and it was, a, it was a natural one, so hell no. <laughs> oh, I see. Oh, she's gonna hear it, she's gonna you're cut gonna, your head holy, off. Holy she's gonna shit. get annihilated. If, okay, no, no, no. Give me out, right? You actually start dating someone, so she gets like that sense that something's fucked up. She develops <laughs> dimension travel to come here and kick your fucking ass. <laughs> <laughs> Even though he's been isekai. <laughs> Holy shit. Yeah. That's crazy. Her sixth sense kicked off. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. Um, I am I am done here and good to go to the, the portal. Uh, I would like to collect a bottle of holy water, but I'm also going to go use the bathroom. So Go for right, it. Shall we take back? a piss on the uh, fountain. Oh. <laughs> Take some holy water. <laughs> <laughs> He's adding more water to <laughs> everything else you guys are doing. I'm gonna say hi to Bart. Bart, you go for it. They they both like you know like how fucking what's called like video game NPCs kind of just had the same like I guess movements. Oh, they're, they're on the same NPCs. life group. Yeah, as you approach them, they both look up. Both of them are cleaning what's called a uh, a white bottle. Oh, oh. hi. Um, and you just, I, you I would say, say Mr. En Enders. Mm. Is that the best way to say it? That's yeah. You can call us that. I just wanted to say uh, uh, thank you for for holding us out over there. Uh, Bart, right? Or was it Bort? It was Bort. Me. Yeah. Uh, thank you. <laughs> no, 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 of course. Finally, you told me you got it. The Enderman. <laughs> that was a joke. <laughs> 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 Damn it, that flew over my head. <laughs> uh, just wanted to say uh, from all of us again, thank you. Uh, I don't think we're going to see you for a while since we got a job to do, but um, just know that well, we'll always have you in our hearts. If that job in includes kicking that, you know, that night's ass, I, I welcome it, so good luck. Oh, definitely. Oh, and uh, I, I I have always wanted to say this. I love both of your stashes and everything. Keep it up. My mind's better, of course. <laughs> Bart says. <laughs> Bart just looks at me like, like, what the fuck? Okay. <laughs> I mean, both of you are twins, so I don't know. Mine's more well kept. But his is more shinier. <laughs> He's been drinking on the job. Maybe that's I've... why. Maybe. Anyways, uh, hopefully we see each other again. He nods. Gee. You have a new friend. Abort. Fuck you, Bart. <laughs> <laughs> anything you guys are doing? I guess, yeah. For the rest of the group, actually, anything you guys like want to like talk to her beforehand? Well, I'll just have like her here. Your bestie. Huh? Huh? Where? Where? The fuck are you talking about? Where? Oh, I'm, I'm sorry, Miss Emily. Or not, no, I'm Emily. I'm talking out I'm of character. Emily. Where are you talking? Oh, I saw I was here. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> no. <laughs> that threw me off. No, I'm, I'm fine. <laughs> I guess we got girl talk, whatever. But, eh. She's been trying to feed, uh... Distinct flowers or these plants, and three should like it's like a tree of some sorts. So oh, it's not really going well. 
Uh, mm, you, you sure you're not gonna cut your hands on that? Do things? Do these things? He what? Uh, no, Emma, they do not. Oh, whoops. Okay. Uh, yeah, and uh, besides that, that's part of my spell. It's not an actual like. It's not. Thing thing. They're <laughs> not blue. It, no, where where do you meet elf that are blue, Emlyn? I've never seen. Well, <sighs> this is one I uh... I try to replicate that my parents told me the story of. I saved them. It was just like this. Ooh, I wonder how it tastes. Are they like blueberries because they're blue? Uh, mm. Mm. Mm, they're kind of I guess gamey. Yeah, I would say. Oh, that's not how my dad described blue things. Well, I mean, this one isn't. Normally, they're not blue. They're like brownish. Oh. Also, another thing: a lot of blue things in the wild are kind of poisonous too. So don't oh. try to lick everything. That's a good thing I haven't tried then. That would be really awful. I wouldn't have been able to meet y'all. Also, now that I'm thinking about it, most things can either be green, blue, or purple. Purple's weird. Purple is a very dangerous color. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe even red sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> My dad's red. He's not dangerous. I mean, I, I, that's implied that you're trying to eat it. I mean, oh. you know, like generally, when it comes to things in nature, bright colors means danger. Very, so, uh, yeah. And I guess in my case, uh, Toko will like put to his scales. Um, due to these scales, my blood is highly dangerous. Huh. You're like one of them frogs, aren't you? As, I don't know. Uh, I give to one of my, I give the Dampier, uh, a severe case of heartburn when they had my blood because we we're what's the damn someone sucked you yes they were aware one of my they were one of my driving companions uh mm, is that like oh that's that's weird the elk uh buttercup seems to, like make a laughing noise or some sorts is very weird because an elk doesn't normally laugh uh-huh just every points at it so is this possible or not what you decide. Do, what is this elk possible? You decide. Emily, possible? you want to ride it? I mean... Oh, yeah, it... I want to ride it. Why does it matter that it's possible or not, Giuseppe? Yeah. So I can decide if I want to write it down and, you know, draw it or not. I mean, Giuseppe, it exists. You can see it. I can see it. It is when... very possible. Then. It's impossible nice. and possible. There. Yeah, Wouldn't something you being understand. possible make it easier to record? Nah. Part mythic, uh, part, uh, part real. Well, you decide. Whatever. Part I'm legend. Part... What part What's of the you isn't real? I mean, I, I can say for Dirk, he has a part of a, a beard on him. Yeah. I suppose. <laughs> what are you looking back on? Uh, Totoko looks back towards the fortune teller and he, like, kind of leads into the seppi. Hey, it's that fortune teller you were talking about. Oh, God. <laughs> yeah. Well, we already know that we're going to get rich. I mean, so. I don't know. You might as well. It, it, sometimes it's worth checking and see if the future has changed. Maybe fate has changed. Eh. No, I decided that it hasn't changed. <laughs> we're still going to get rich. I decided. But maybe there could be extra fortune our way if we check out yeah that's convincing i'll do it just playing uh or she's playing with cards uh toko oh as he just as he walks away toko does like it's a, a kind of like a smug smile and he just kind of sits back okay how much is it for fortune I'll talk to them first <laughs> okay so how much <laughs> is it for fortune oh you, you you want a fortune right now Mm. Oh, I'll make the first one free. Whatever. Yeah. Mm, okay, your palm. Free. Okay. I, I guess I take my glove off. Show them my palm. Let's roll. Okay, actually, fuck. <laughs> You'll be facing in a very. Not powerful, but. 
pesky adversary in the future. Is that all? You want more? I'm kind of not in the mood. Eh, okay. Well, thank you. Thank you for the free fortune. I didn't I didn't realize fortune tellers could just be like, eh, I'm not fortune right now. <laughs> yeah, they can. You're unfortunate. <laughs> I think the next fortune, if you were to ask, was just going to be shit. <laughs> Anything the rest of y'all gonna do? Or don't know if you can have a conversation now, but in, a, in VC. So this guy can also be a. I'm ready to go into the uh, ship whenever I collected my holy water. And I think the rest of us are ready too. Yeah. Uh, I do have one question is uh, the head in Sparks' little house over there still? So... Oh, uh, you don't know that. Time to find out. <laughs> you don't there know. Kirby, am I in my little uh, office? And you're in your little office? You want to be in your little office? No. I don't, <laughs> Why I don't, the fuck I'm, are you I'm, saying I'm, like that? I'm asking you, <laughs> am I there? Gosh, it's, like, there. it's like asking a little toddler, are you Kirby, in your office, baby? And I'm just seeing the fucking it. like, mama, mama. Yeah. He's presenting it like he's playing with like dolls in like a Barbie dream house. I basically am. That's D and D for a DM. Like I'm not fucking around. Yeah. 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 Uh, uh hello. Hello. Post. I'll tell go. Is there something you need? Uh, I was just gonna check on something real quick. The you know the head. In the... Oh, that. Uh, he'll, he'll, she'll open the door. All right. What? Toko walks in. What? Why does our party keep just walking away from each other without telling anyone? Uh, hello, Spark. I lack social skills. Uh, and, and it's also because that's how we all came together in the same place. Ah. Uh, oh. Same habits. I see. Maybe that should be our party name. We shall, we shall be like. Same habits. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What? What were you gonna say? I was gonna say weirdos, but I, I think same habits. <laughs> uh, Does that have a nice ring to it? <laughs> Handing over to Toliko. Back to Toliko. Yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah, Miss Toliko. How can I help you? Uh, I just wanted to check on the head, not like more so progress. Like I just wanted to see it for a second. Oh, right. Uh. Uh, I so, guess you can have you can order Wilma balls to get it. She'll fetch it back from the uh, internal library. And what do you want to do? With it? It's, <laughs> it's currently in the library right now. I keep it in a safe. Uh, it's, it's here. Toko R is going to do a quick <laughs> analyze it. <laughs> he's just gonna he's just gonna look it down to see if there's any changes, as magic wise and also physically. Arcana. So Wait, hold on, Sparks. Hold on, hold on. Hold on. Where, where is it? Holding? Uh... God damn, want me to roll Arcana for you? No, no, I'm helping Toloko. Okay. <laughs> you know, you could have just said, I'm gonna help Toloko, and I just go for that well, shit. I, no, look, I, I wanted to click it, okay? Oh my god. Alright, uh, you see Spark? Help you from the distance. I'm not sure how. So roll again. Toko. I I explain how you how you uh how you can better do it. See, look at that. My help's paid off already. It's like the oh yeah, he has a beard too. So it's you know like the guy like with the, like the marker board. He's like explaining stuff. It's like let's go to these that up. <laughs> the gift. <laughs> Hold on, I'll, I'll fucking post it in the cogs. Yeah, I have no clue. What it Are is. you talking about like an auctioneer? No, no, oh, the the meme, the meme of the oh. guy like writing on the whiteboard. Mm. Oh, he's he's he was explaining. Ah, uh. yeah, I, I know which one. It was used in the in Matthew's video. <laughs> what do you want to learn specifically about head? <laughs> uh, how does one obtain head? Yeah, how do, how do I get that? Uh, <laughs> there no head. Compared to last time, are there any differences? Uh, nope. Okay, and I assume they'll pwned it in magic too, and so that nightmare sauce that we had last time. Okay, and I'm gonna assume physically it hasn't like started decaying. Nope. 
Mm, interesting. I don't know if it's like that's been tampered with or yeah, but that check, yeah, it's not been tampered with, so yeah, it hasn't decayed. Huh. Interesting. It hasn't decayed at all. This life yes. and death magic must be some really potent stuff. It's it's incredibly potent. I uh I wield a I wield a fragment of uh the other kind of magic, and it allows me to pull off some interesting feats. I see. Uh, Toko's gonna like I like, hold the head up for a second and be like, "I will be back. Act to do further research on you. Just you, just wait." He doesn't say. He's just, that's just kind of look he gives, and he pick. Uh, roll out what's called intimidation. No, roll okay. me a wisdom save. Oh. <laughs> Ah, right, cool. no issue. Right. Wait, oh, can I? Oh, wait, hold on. Can the help action assist with saving throws? No. Actually, yeah. Next ability check. Okay. No, wait, no. Additionally, when you use, I don't think so. So. Next ability check or a, or safe, attack? Safe. No, it doesn't. All right. Cool. I think you'd have to, I guess, like, oh yeah. If you know if there's a fireball like coming your way, I'm gonna prepare for the fireball and give someone the help action by you know pushing them off. You can like I think it's very situational in regards to help action, but base help action, no. So like helping a saving helping a wisdom saving throw is yeah, how the fuck are you gonna pull that off? Uh I tell him how to be more wise. Yeah, good luck. Kirby's way of helping in that scenario of a fireball is just he's gonna like go up next to them, start checking them off like a uh, mortal style, and then like <laughs> Push him onto the ground <laughs> to make sure it hits them. <laughs> you kick though. Uh, but yeah, Toko just kind of gives like a "I'll be back, act for you soon." Just you wait, and then pits nothing, and pits the head heads back down. Nothing happens to a head, and uh, Wilma has a concerned look. <laughs> you don't need to focus on it so much. I I can handle it. Although. I've recently uh, had quite a few things uh, that are taking priority over it, so it yeah. may be a while. But yes, uh, we shall be heading off now. Very well. Hopefully you don't have issues like last time. Uh, probably not. Oh yeah, if we meet Stein and I again, we'll try our best. I would advise you retreat as soon as you are capable, but... I pray he's not there, but good luck to you. Uh, as Tolka exits the door, his, like, his cape kind of uh, flares out. Coco um, filming! Oh no, he's, he's being an anime protagonist. Himself. He did the thing. Look he did the go. thing! Finally! The, thing. the anime counter. Holy shit. Holy fuck. Holy fuck, Lois. Uh, yeah, I got a party <laughs> here. I'm ready to leave. You Are must you gather your party before venturing forth. No, check. it's king, check. Time. <laughs> it's king time. King time. Go off, king. I don't Go remember off, going here. Oh, you know, Buttercup brought me here. I remember now. <laughs> did, did you not remember him trotting away? Okay. See, I wasn't moving my legs, so I didn't know. I, I kind of thought, you know, like... Did you have your eyes closed? Were you scared? Why would it be scared? I was scared of heights. Are, are you? A little bit. At least I can oh. admit it. Yeah, you have to close your eyes. Especially if you're writing this. It's pretty high up. I'll get used to it. <clears throat> oh, you you already? Yes. Alright. And, uh... Catch will begin to lead you to the Cloud Gazer. Let me oh my gosh, bye towel. King! Bye bestie! <laughs> <laughs> they wave, bye bye! So, bye so bye. long, Opie! Bye bestie. <laughs> what the fuck? Who is that? 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 Who is so long, Opie? No, oh, uh, okay. I said that out of character. <laughs> Kaylee no, just I... appears. <laughs> Oh like, my gosh, Battle Bestie! <laughs> like, imagine it's just, it's like a random civilian and, and who knows us is just like, so yeah, bye, Oofy. Let me put my, let me put the PCs in here first, so. Yeah, Hi, RP, you know. Do I have everyone? Oh yeah, I need your Hi, fucking horse. God damn, coconut. It's an, Not coconut, it's buttercup. It's coconut's an dead. elk! 
<laughs> Listen, everyone uses a horse if they're normal, so I wouldn't know. I thought horses were like almost extinct. They're extinct. It's a rare commodity. We're not having horses right now. Okay, I mean, they're elk. extinct, but like I'm pretty sure you know, as a paladin, I would always pick a horse. <laughs> well, you like to conform because you're 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 dumb. You're not invited to my birthday party. The party what's called just leads you guys to basically what's called the unfinished dogs of uh, hard not hard fucking grand bush. Actual thing. For what should be a car normal cargo ship, you guys can tell that the cloud gazer, the ship you guys are on, is very well above its fucking class. It's made of very sturdy and fucking expensive uh hard of wood. For the Harokian people, you know that that shit's very expensive and also very sturdy, durable, light, oh, right. and also fireproof. We Great upgraded. for Phoenicians. We upgraded the ship. Yeah. Um, and damn. That upgrade, yeah, the upgrade, uh, <laughs> you oh, made wow. the entire hole apparently fucking made of hard oak. Wait, yeah, doesn't it regenerate? <laughs> it regenerates, uh, what's called immune to fire, or what's called very resistant to fire, and a long rest here is four hours instead of eight hours. So, potentially you have faster travel time, because the pilots are, you know, fucking working overtime. Oh, uh, the sails you guys can see from the airship are formed with, like, thick clouds protruding from these crystals, holding sort of, like, energy. People from the harbor can tell that they're usually formed by uh, crystallizing uh, air elementals. We don't talk yeah. about the, uh, what's it called, <laughs> moral morality of that, but... <laughs> so that's why they call... So that's why they call it the Cloud Gazer. On the side of the ship is a mural made from light blue paint with the words Cloud Gazer. Also depicting alongside the words Cloud Gazer is a very large crew. With some people, it's a pretty absurd crew. Like, there's a lot of people you think that with a crew like this, ain't no way like everyone's fucking fitting in it. Yeah, uh, <laughs> some there's a lot of what's called familiar faces in this world. People that you could obviously recognize as just Taven, Spark, and Novar. It just epic can tell uh, the Archmage is there as well. Arvix. And there's also that weird red haired individual. We don't talk about that. But yeah. So you guys see on the what's called exterior of the uh, Cloud Gazer. And the Cloud Gazer soon begins to take off by itself. This, I, I didn't Casual know Nirvana was part of Spock's party. Oh, whoa. Should have told well, Spock was. about him. It, it, it was, you know, for a for, Kinda joined early, or not early, kinda late, you know. In our trip, you know, adventure. We met in the Dragon Isles, fought a bunch of spiders. We all went to the Dragon Isles? Mm hmm. Went to the Dragon Isles, helped some Phoenician people, and then we killed, uh. Mm. Y'all know Gabrala, the warlord of the Phoenix? I've heard. Really, I've rather. Heard. Oh, yeah, we dealt with her as well. Good. But yes, Bible State again. Um, damn, this is a nice airship. Yes. No, it sure fucking is. <laughs> this... With the living, it seems, this party was experiencing it. This airship is quite remarkable. Just looking at it, I can tell the build is sniffly better than previous airships I've been on. And yeah, this... this wasn't a uh, cargo ship. Oh my goodness, this would be... One of the finest ships ever made, but I, I think this is, you know, definitely above its uh, weight class. Mm -hmm. I do say so myself. Is there any defenses? <laughs> uh... That's our one problem. Well, uh, if you think we about it, we all are. We, we are, are the defense. I mean, that, right. but and... you could also technically say that just looking at these boards, it seems like they'll... they'll fit themselves back together if there is any damage back on it. And that's what the, uh, that's what, you know, the party, I call them the Codex party, that's what they like to think. Mm. They're the, they're out of offense and kind of just hide in the ship. Hmm. The character. more on speed and durability than anything they're else. They're very stupid, Yolo, not Yolo Vic. <laughs> I don't know why you didn't buy upgrades for guns or shit. <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna say, out of character, you guys had so many opportunities, but you never did it. And also, if you guys figure out, or if you think about it, why would a ship need regeneration? That means that the fucking pilot crashed the ship a lot of times. <laughs> or to There's more danger than not. <laughs> uh, I have two stories for this. Uh, so, for the hard oak, what's called a hard oak hole upgrade? 
we kind of spent all our money in that. We couldn't buy anything else. <laughs> <laughs> and the second thing was, we had one instance where uh, we kind of, or there was like a huge hole in the airship. Spark, Cassid, Ek, and I just scorched her. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, blew up a hole now, in the side of the ship. It was very important to take out those harpies, okay? Dan literally said, I'm firing my laser. <laughs> yeah, it blew a hole. Very important. Spark said, I'm about to blow. <laughs> I'm about to blow. <laughs> Those, those harpies are giving us trouble. Uh, you guys can move freely, like if you want. Like I'll show them. Like, you can go, so you can go we, here if you want. We can move freely. Yay! Yeah! There is no. I guess for like downstairs, you kind of go through here. We have a very shitty uh downstairs. Yeah, you can go. Th you can go through here or here. Whoa. It's kind of like a mm. drop down that, or like. Like those fucking jungle gyms, right? Like the whole uh, ropes and shit. Mm -hmm. Like canvas ropes, right? Like you climb up them. Yeah, that's what it is. You like open the door, like you can jump down, or you can climb up through the uh, this pole over here, which is, like I said, the eight ropes. Let's just say it's a ladder. Yeah, how yeah, many the fucking ladder ropes. That's what I meant. That's what I meant. Oh. How, how many um, uh, deck hands are are out right now? Deck hands. I'd say yeah. like four. Farther. I'm not putting that because you're not me. Understandable. Uh, Dale says hi, bye, uh, getting acquainted while hi. I go do shit. <laughs> you can go downstairs. I, if you're going I downstairs, hope, you'll be here. I, I hope we can get into airship combat so whenever like an enemy majorly misses the mark, I just go, No, Jim! No! <laughs> just start freaking out. Yeah! <laughs> I'm, I'm deckhand. <laughs> <laughs> Spouting random names. <laughs> wait, wait, hold on. Wait, what did you say about the deckhand? I, I said I can't wait until we get into ship combat, and then like an enemy rolls a crit fail and like broadsides the boat, and then in a random order, just go, No! Jim! He was the best of us all! No! And then NPC that doesn't exist. <laughs> Alright. Uh, Alright, what are you guys doing? So, uh, so catch. Um, <clears throat> what, how, like, what's the crystals for? Crystals, oh, we use these for, uh, they're our power source, right? And you see those, like, uh, our sails are kind of made of clouds. Mm -hmm. As I, from, you know, fitting our name, it's also, well, uh, our power. I don't really ask me why, I kind of just inherited this ship. <laughs> the other engineers are kind of, you know, taking a vacation after our whole quote unquote traumatic experience. For me, it's more of a, uh, I like to say it's more of a eye opening one. Uh -huh. Yeah, so. I, I don't really question it. I just fly it. Cause like, this is similar to some of the other things I've seen on a different airship I used to be on. But I've never seen such big crystals before. Instead, it was more so like a ring around the ship. A ring. Yeah. I remember that. Hmm. Yes. Well. I think bigger airships could accommodate for a ring. Might be a new fancy, I guess, style of it, but I, I, I ain't too sure. <laughs> you know, tech, tech is not really my, kind of my type of thing. Well, um, can't wait to see these these things in action. Well, there you're flying right now. Kind of a smooth chip, so there you go. <laughs> <sighs> well, I, I think you guys shall, you know, probably make yourselves acquainted here, because it is gonna. We're going to City Blades, right? No, uh, yes. Got it. Ah. <sighs> well, make yourself a com Yeah, check check the downstairs. You haven't seen the rest of it. Open seas, the breeze. It reminds me of good times. <laughs> right, like that. everyone else. Going downstairs? Ah, uh, Toko's heading downstairs. Okay, oh, I'll wait for you. As Ketch said, I'll, I'd go downstairs as well, because Ketch just suggested it. He'll bring up his question later. No, you say your fucking question first. Fuck you. Uh -huh. Alright, he'll, uh, he'll, he'll go to Ketch, and he goes, um... Do you have anyone else that takes over the wheel, in case we get into any trouble? It's not from the ship decks, uh... Oh! You're gonna be here if you're gonna like it too. The name's Basha. Oh mm. no. 
Yeah. She's okay, downstairs, so I think. The I, other I, I was asking if you could potentially teach me in case the case arises where someone other than you needed to teach you. Know, well, I can teach you. <clears throat> I'll see hey. when we have some, you know, feet on. Yes, yeah, so you when we're not traveling. Out of character, guys, don't be weirded out when she asks to eat your corpse. That's normal lizard stuff. <laughs> Unless she's just not a lizard folk. Alright, downstairs. Let me get my notes. Uh, you guys make the interior downstairs, climbing down a ladder made of rope. <clears throat> the interior is quite nice, just like the exterior. It's very clean because, well, it's not really used a lot. So it's very fresh, very shiny, and uh, clean of blood. No murders here. <laughs> it's kind of like a, think of like a well kept, like a well kept cabin. It has this cozy feeling, maybe you know, extended by the hard oak. Maybe it's magic, or maybe it's just a uh, what's it called, just a general exterior of the airship. Mm. Uh, uh, if one were to go here, pointing here, it's a very large kitchen with alongside a lot of supplies strapped down to the ground. Very cozy fucking kitchen. You can see a lizard folk person cooking. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Can't believe it. Oh my gosh. <laughs> what was that for? <laughs> it's fucking base trap. You have a meeting table. If one were to go to a room, it's very kind of small, but also at the same time a lot of like not like you know, not like airplanes of today. You have bunk beds. I, I did purchase bunk beds, so I'm I'm remembering this. <laughs> you have bunk beds to accommodate for, I suppose, the huge ass group that you saw earlier. <laughs> and over here is the captain's quarters. Yep. Over here, you can see a deer head. Holy and shit! Here is hey! fuck. Oh fuck! Holy shit! Oh fuck! There's a cabinet here. Seems. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> and the cabinet seems to be holding some stuff. Seems like books and other papers, but it's very messy. Very intriguing. A uh, question about the bunk beds. Yeah. Are they secured or are they fastened and secured properly onto the ship so that if uh, there's irregular movement, they don't just flip over? <laughs> they are now. <laughs> okay, good. Good, good. So I don't think the there's, old group would have cared. There's, there's, actually, there's actually like a single room <laughs> that, that doesn't have it. Well, this was Hana's room, so I imagine this one was like just moving around. Nice. Alright. Uh, you, you go with the descriptions? Yep. Okay. Yeah. Um, funny stuff. As we see this thing like, cooking, and uh, you don't know what she's cooking. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I would, uh, and if it would like walk up with the party, and then be like, um, greetings. Uh, and he'll do like a small formal bow when he goes on. We are your guests for the time of travel. Um, it is nice to meet you. Um, I've been waiting for you. Fresh meat bags. Welcome aboard. My name is Baystraw. I'll be your co-captain in the Cloud Gator. Glad to meet you, Baystraw. You all smell very wonderful. I hope you enjoy in our uh, humble abode up in the airship. Also my home, I'm homeless. No, uh, I mean, you have the ship, it's your home, no? Oh, this is my mobile home. I don't actually have a home outside, but I like it here. Mm -hmm. then, oh, it's, good around. then it's good enough to be called home, and thus you're not homeless, no? I suppose, but so puffy is it really my thing. Fair enough. Fair enough. Yeah, yeah. Anyways, uh, nice to meet you, Del. Nice to meet you, Del. I'm Paige. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I'm just messing with you. Yeah, yeah I know. Uh, and... I am Toko. Uh, what are you cooking there, if I may ask? I don't know. May I have a taste? Uh, we yeah. served up some mystery meat, but mystery is misspelled with an I. Holy shit, Baker is like a lunch lady. Oh my gosh, I love her even more. <laughs> Serving up mystery meat. <laughs> okay. Eat, uh... It tastes some sort of too. At least, at least you can taste beef. But it's like I don't know what else is in it. And like, I'm not sure like why I don't know what it is. Uh, do I have to roll Constitution save? <laughs> no, you don't. Oh, good. It's just weird tasting. Like, 
I can describe it as like when my mom fucking puts coconut in like some stews. It's like why? <laughs> why is it there? It's not, it's not gonna make me puke. Oh, well, it might make me puke, but like for normal people, it won't because because I hate coconut. It's like just why, right? Hmm. <laughs> yeah, I, I don't know why you would put dog in it. Holy shit. Oh, interesting <laughs> and peculiar, but quite interesting flavor. Thank you. This is my first time making it. Not bad. Usually I eat things raw. But I have to accommodate for other people. A strong stomach. We, we appreciate you accommodating for us weaker people. No, no, you're not weak. You're just built different. That's what I've been told. Mm -hmm. I, I, yeah, I'm, I'm built not different. Curious. Curious. Can I try something too? Go ahead. Hmm. It's exactly as I described it until ago. I don't know what the fuck am I eating. <laughs> I don't know what I'm eating. <laughs> I don't want to eat more. Like, I want to eat this again. <laughs> mm, yeah, that's okay. That's good. And, and no. Maybe, maybe like a kick to it. Maybe. If you want, you can take over cooking. I'm. Truth be told, I only eat raw meat, so flavoring something I'm not really keen at. But then we can do it together. Yeah. You sure you barely even know me? Nah, nah we'll, we'll, I think I think we'll we'll get along just fine. And besides, it's a good experience well, to get to know someone by cooking with someone. Oh, that is fair. You sound like one of my friends. What, what a better way to bond. Remember a hearty meal. Mm-hmm. I just should, I should miss him. Uh, who's your friend, perhaps? Oh, I'm friend. actually referring to, like, that's what I'm referring to around. I get, yeah, two people. Uh, they're one of them is the art mage, known as Garvix, and the other one is always Phalar. Both mm -hmm. very tasty. Oh, Phalar. I think I remember that name. Wasn't he the one with... Oh, I think he was the one at the house. He was like one of the former owners. And what oh, was... Yeah. And what was the other one's name? Like, did we get His that? Name. The, the other house owner or... Yes, yeah, the other house owner. Uh, Spark told us that they were a part of the same group. Remind me, what did they look like? Were they red? Wait, that's um, what did they describe them? Was it? Oh, uh, I think actually, it, uh, Toko will like wrap his cloak around. Uh, I think they had an association with this thing. Oh, why are you wearing that? Oh, hold on. It. Uh, Isn't that theirs? Uh, I mean, the house was abandoned, no. Uh, you... it wasn't... <laughs> we had, we own it legally now, we were given a lease. Oh, okay, everything, everything's fine then. Yeah. I'm like, also not keen at it. Did you take someone's bath hanger? Uh, no, this was like a, I think a, I'm pretty sure like a banner in their house. Honestly, if Toluco did that, it looked like the, the, the... the... The curtains on the on the, the tub, then that that would be a little bit too much. Uh, no, no, I wouldn't take it from the tub, but that's Ooh. for the tub only. <laughs> it's a symbol of it, it's the Crimson Phoenix symbol, so it's like it, I, I I don't not I'm not sure where you're going at. Is this like a stylistic choice? Uh, I uh, a cloak around you with uh, the symbol of the bird. Uh, I don't really know. I, I just thought it looked nice, and I was like, okay, I don't really have like a coat or a jacket, so I just made this my coat, my cloak. I could teach you how to skin an animal. You can wear that. Uh, I do not skin an animal, but it is a. Uh, it's. Eh, it takes a while. Just be careful wearing that in public. I'm surprised that no one's really bad in an eye or commented on this yet. Yeah, yeah. Like us. You know, you're. Are you from the heart of or uh, Are you from the Dragon House? Or are you uh, from... I'm not from around here at all. Okay, the meat bags in the heart of. Okay, the meat bag. The from the Phoenix, the Crimson Phoenix. 
a lot of raids and a lot of well raids. Uh, so, I love. I I see. Um, should I just uh, like stop wearing this then? I, I told. I mean, told you gonna... mean good, but, but like, do you want to make enemies or allies? Maybe I don't know. Uh, not enemies. anymore anymore. It's, it's really just you know old people who I guess be upset at that. Well, not really old people, but the old, the old timers, timers would be upset that, that you know they're allies. She, she says that in a what's called. Quotation marks, like finger quotation marks. Uh, um, Toko uh, flips the symbol over so it's not facing outwards and then <laughs> fits it back on. Smart choice, but if you're a ballsy, I like that. You obviously have the symbol showing me. Your choice, though. True, but I do not know much about this place, so it's best you not draw unwanted attention. Ask your party members, maybe they know. Also, you just got some more flim in your cup. Oh, well. Sorry. Tea? Uh, n no, that there was uh, my throat was just like I, it was. You know, <laughs> uh, <laughs> I, uh, <laughs> the, the, the stew was the stew uh was caught in my throat a bit. It was good though. Oh, oh, no. Alright. <laughs> now I remember. One of the uh, deck, deck hands, one of the people I rehired. I don't really know them, but they kind of got taken away by a harpy. They're not really taken away, but they fell off. Unfortunate. Oh. He was a very tasty back too, but uh, no left. You see that? Uh, someone opened the door. I, I opened the door. Do you see that deer? Mm hmm. That's a cabinet. You can take some spell scrolls over there, they'll help you. They're the ones that make you not fall. Huh? Oh, that, that's Emmeline. No, not, not Emmeline. No, <laughs> Emmeline. <laughs> I, I, I what? Know, which is the case? The case that's over here. I open the cabinet. You open the cabinet. It's uh, very messy, filled with books of like random bullshit. Like how to operate a fucking airship for dummies. <laughs> as well as some spell scrolls. If you turn the spell scrolls over, over you can tell they're uh, spell, spell, yeah. spell scrolls of uh, feather falling. Hmm. Six of them. This could be good for one of us to have. I I mean, there's six of them. Yes, but we wouldn't want to take all of them, right? right? What about the other deckhands and the other people when they're not? Please don't them? take all of them. Exactly. Um, okay, then we take one. Any any books of interesting and interesting note, and I'll hand to look up to the spell spell. The only book really it is honestly just the uh, how to act, how to what's called how to run an airship <laughs> or how to what's called fly an airship. Yeah, I'll read that. Ah, okay, airship have, flying. Uh, scroll, uh, what's called spell scroll of the feather falling. You can write that down to your book if you want. I have the spell, sadly. Sadly, give it to the spellcaster. Yeah, I gave it to Toko. Okay, I will put that in my inventory. Um, I will. Uh, I, I, I'll just keep talking. I'll, I'll add this Toko so I'm gonna be ready for reading. Um, I might be able to glean more knowledge. We could learn something. Um, your voice comes to wear. About the airship and whatnot. Ah, yes, that would be a good idea. Although, I have flown an airship before. Hmm. That is good to hear. I've actually never been on an airship one myself. My... Life was very stagnant. Well, now your life flows like the river in the water below us. Seems like it does. Um, Ever-changing, but continuously forward. Shall we pick our rooms? Uh, I... I'm bugging with Evelyn. Ooh, ooh, I want this room. <laughs> I don't. I don't think that's. that's but it's so good. nice here. Look, there's nice chairs. Ooh, there's it's a bed a... for two people. Uh, it does look very nice. For me. Uh, I do not think it is for you. Uh, Toko's gonna like Aww. walk up to Evelyn, like kind of like lift her up off the bed. Uh, that's this is the captain's quarters. Oh, well. Maybe, maybe, 
Yeah, maybe you can talk to your captain and take some naps here while we're still traveling. Uh, and also Togo's gonna look for like any like if Ellen messed the bed up a little. <laughs> yeah, she did. She, she jumped on it. Uh, Togo <laughs> with her boots on. Togo. <laughs> Oh, she's, she's she's gonna have to walk the plank. You know? I mean, like on her side, not on like other boots. Uh, Toko's gonna strain the bed out out before exiting. No, you can't cover the evidence, Toko. You're gonna have to walk the plank as well. Shit, man, not this the first time about high heights. Oh, I'm gonna know. You can bunk with me. It's fine. Where are we going? I, I want the best seat in the uh in in the uh in the uh the uh, the, uh, the uh, and they all seem pretty equal to me. I'm not sure if that's a nice one. Mm, I mean, let's, take a look. Let's take a look. Uh, Alright, uh, uh, Spark. Uh, sorry, not Spark. Uh, Dergus is going to. Dergus is going to quickly check the bunk beds. Are, is there one that looks nicer than the others? Oh, what's called? You're all good. It's as if like, they prepared for you know, your arrival. Uh, oh, very good. Toko's going to take this one that's closest to the cabin quarters. All, all, all seem pretty good. I'm yeah, going to just pick one based on what side of the ship you'd like to be on. Ooh, the right side! Oh, oh wait, are there those fancy ship names we need to use, like, Bald? Starboard. I mean, yes, but when you're in the heat of battle, that kind of goes to the wayside. Or I guess the port side. I also don't know what that means, so... <laughs> <laughs> Where you can do those turns, right? Mm, yeah. You can, but for the most part, all you need to know is, you know, just... Where you are in the ship, in comparison to others. Right, right. I think it'd probably be best if I... Had easy access of getting onto that deck as fast as possible. Yes, that is quite useful in the case of emergencies. Exactly. Oh, I agree. Me too. Let's start picking you. this one. <laughs> but uh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I yield. <laughs> Anything you guys are gonna do? You basically have essentially an hour before. Two hours, rather, before you make it to a uh, city of Blades. Uh, they're gonna be, like tidy up the bunk beds that he's gonna take. Oh, got it. And, uh, sweep, sweep away any trash and set down his equipment. Strangely, you feel kind of sleepy. Ah. Tolko has been afflicted by a sleeping curse. To like, Toko's like, I want to play a flute. I'm in a good mood, but oh, look. Ugh, I'm kind of tired. Oh, I guess I should get some rest. Uh, Toko gets to like the top of the bunk, like the top bunk, and then just curls up in a ball. <laughs> Badass. Just kidding. <laughs> Anything the rest of you guys doing? Uh, Navik thinks, thinks about making a jab by uh, suggesting that him and Durga should share a room because they're bunk beds. But then, but then he decides against it and goes into a separate room and begins to read. Damn, what a shame. What about you, Giuseppe and Zell? Uh, uh, I'm just gonna run around. I, guess, I don't know. Does anyone seem like they'd be in the bunking mood? Now that's chill with whatever. <laughs> but but the, he's he's totally in the punking mood right about now. <laughs> I, I walk I walk into his room. And is Zerg taking the bottom or top bunk? Is he a top or bottom? No. I mean, like, uh, wait, no, I can, so I can answer if Durgus is top or bottom with the slap bracelet, and by a process of elimination, whatever Durgus is not, is what, uh, uh he is. Uh, so, the Tolko and Durgus friendship bracelet, so, Tolko's the top, Durgus is the bottom, therefore, Giuseppe's the top. What, what? Okay. Alright. What kind of quantum physics is this, dude? 
Oh, okay, so... They want to where they are by not knowing where they are and where they're not. Oh, well... Oh, opposites attract. No, no, then... Okay, so let me explain. So when it comes to... <laughs> <laughs> when, it comes to when it comes to shipping and fandoms and all that, the first one is the top oh and the second one is the oh, bottom. Man. And on the description for the Tolkien and Durgis bracelet, Tolkien is the top and Durgis is the bottom, therefore Durgis is the bottom, <laughs> and therefore just so he must be a top in this case. I imagine you guys are having a conversation. <laughs> and you're in the, the fucking main part here. And then Gregus would be like, the bottom's easier to reach, but you do not have to run you know, as complicated. Alright, imagine he just cuddles like next to him. <laughs> Good morning! Good morning! Good morning, bestie. No, this one will take the top bunk. Okay. Like, no, that nice. Zeppi seems like the type of sleepwalker to get into your bed with you and snuggle up. Cooking special taste. Yeah, to get yeah, the yeah, basic show. We're gonna get the basic show, yeah. Okay. Cook. How do you salt white woman? <laughs> she, she ain't white. She ate raw meat. You think she knows how to f like, season her food? She's white. Let's be real. Only, only the the, the rare exception where they start eating in dirt. <laughs> That's too spicy for her palate. Dirt? Damn. No, 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 no. Salt. Yeah, yeah, exactly. We gotta use salt. Going on a tangent, like I thought lesser folks would be a lot more. God, God damn, I'm, I'm tripping. You're, you're tripping balls. Listen, like, if anything, have... dragonborns. Are a lot yeah, more yeah. You, don't, you don't see. Dwarves too, yeah. but I'm forcing dwarves though. <laughs> but lizard folk, that's still strange to me. So we're gonna teach you how to cook uh, with salt? Yeah, we're gonna start with salt and then. Uh, what's salt? What the fuck? Salt. Uh, and then next we use fucking. Uh, 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 tomorrow we use fucking pepper. Are you teaching her by like memory or like how do you want to teach her? So this will determine like what kind of check you're gonna roll. Uh, I guess uh, to double look or any type of salt. And then they, they, if they, there's yeah, any, like salt. like what kind is like tiny like, like powdery almost or are there like powdery. like like there are chunks. Powdery. Powdery. Uh, I guess she'll like cup some. I, I, here, try, try some of this. Kind of like put put your finger in and then like uh, lick it from there. Do meat bags like this? It's weird. Well, normally what you do is you get your 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 meat seared and then you put it on top after the fact. Look at a nice uh taste to it. Okay, I'll accommodate it accordingly. You can also do this with other uh, type of things. It doesn't have to be with just meat. I, I think I'll personally stick with. Eating raw meat, but for the rest of you, if you enjoy this, sure. And you teach uh, Beisha how to fucking make steak. Because that's pretty simple. Just salt that shit, pepper, easy. Salt the steak. Uh, are you guys doing anything? Naveen? Hey, Naveen, where are you reading? Yeah, yeah. Oh, that's like, what, two hours? You need more time than that. You guys calling up for some shit? How big is this? I guess really Giuseppe uh, speaks up and he's like, he, he, he's like, I know a guy from the city of Blades. Actually, it's the exact same guy before. Uh, yeah, I, his name was Soaks. He's like a bandit guy. He, he came from the city of Blades. But he moved to uh, Ardo probably because of of uh, that one bandit guy. Matthew, uh, is Giuseppe poking his head from the top to the bottom, or does he have his legs dangling off of the bed? Adrian King, I forgot how to check his name. Okay, sorry. Also, like, if people are talking in the background, so I feel the need to, like, not take pauses when talking. But, uh, he probably has his, he's not dangling. He's, he's laying fully on the bed. Okay. He's normal. Yeah. yeah. All right. Uh, interesting. Do you think? Well, if I ever see him, I'll, I'll say, hey, I, I know your friend Giuseppe. Eh. Okay. 
He's not exactly a friend, but he was nice enough. I know your acquaintance, Giuseppe. Yeah. Uh, eventually, what's called? <clears throat> the airship starts, uh, I guess, going down, going downwards, and it's nearing the city of Blades. All right, so, you ready to go downstairs? I think we're almost there, Giuseppe. You ready to get stabbed by the city? Yeah, I wonder if they actually have hair salons here. I just made that up earlier, but maybe they do. Probably, city. Depends on how big the city is. Yeah. Ooh, Del, Del, Del! <laughs> He's gonna shake you. Uh, 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 yeah, yeah. We're here! I think. I have a question, though. I kind of just... realized it. Uh-huh. Why are we here you again? I, I kind of forgot. Oh, we're picking up dirt. Not, not Durgus. Durgus is here. Yeah, Durgus is over there, yeah. Brooding still. Uh, we're here to pick up uh, Chadikus. How do we find him? The sending stone? <laughs> the sending stone that we've been using? No, 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 no. I was trying to do it for comedic like, fuck you, Spark! <laughs> <laughs> I thought you legitimately forgot. I, I know this! <laughs> What do you think he's known? How can I tell that you know? I'm doing it for comedic yeah. effect. Fuck! <laughs> All right, well, continue with comedic effect. <laughs> Damn! Wait, we don't know how to find him. Uh, I'll put like a <laughs> a finger to her chin and be like, uh, a magic, uh, communication. Still surprised he didn't talk to me about it, but you know that's just how it goes. But he said he's over there now. But it's a city, right? I think cities are big. Oh well, I mean, if 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 Toluco really knows the the real Chatticus or, or another Chatticus, then I think he'd probably pick up on where he is. Imposter Chatticus? Should we, we should ask him? Help me, Del. I'm just gonna try to drag you. Uh, uh, <laughs> he's just, like, as a mother to a child, just kind of just like, just oh no, you're dragging me dude, away. He didn't actually even say, he didn't specify where. He didn't even say you meet at the City of Blades. He just said, I'm at the City of Blades. Uh, yeah, okay. that, that's what I was trying to go for, damn it. <laughs> uh, she gonna, what's called, click, click, unlock. She gonna Mr. Down. Tolico, wake up. Uh, how's Toko doing with his sleep-induced thing? <laughs> you wake up, but it feels like you haven't slept at all. You just felt like time skipped. Ah, uh, that... <sighs> what the... Huh? Morning, sleepyhead. It... What? Mr. Sleepyhead, how are you finding To... Or not Toko, you're Toko. How are you finding Chaticus? And how do you find yourself at the same time? That was a joke. But yeah, how... It... He never really gave us a location. Do you have any ideas? Wait, hold on. How, how long was I asleep? Like two uh, hours. Two, three hours? What? Like I was asleep for two hours? It only felt like a minute. Oh no, kind of scares at you. <laughs> I think I have an idea. That is odd. Okay. Uh, What's your idea, just... Mr. Scary Navid Man? <laughs> I. Thank you, um, but we, we were tracking a weapon of his, correct, Giuseppe? Um, could oh, he still has the shield on him, I can track it, yeah. Mm -hmm. And we'd, we'd be within that range, right? It's like, what, five miles, one mile, ten miles? What? I, I guess if you have that funny spell, you can also track his, like, weapon, right? Or his glasses, like, is or that no. Or oh, his bucket of chicken! We just, he we does track his can you even track a chicken bucket? Well, I asked, Toliko, the bucket. I asked Toliko for the spices, and he wouldn't tell me, so I can't check that. So unless he has the buggy field on we him. We have his glasses, though, and, or, and his, you know, his, like, his weapon. No, it so has to be an animal. Or a plant. Oh, okay. 
objects? It, oh, an animal. So if he oh. has a shield on it, on him. So that that possum of a hairline of his, you can't track that either. No. Maybe if it's an animal. <laughs> uh, but like a parasite for like worms. For how we're we gonna find Traticus? Uh, well, aside from, like, what, the Sinning Stones, the Bug Shield tracking, the rest of it is probably just intuition, if I know him. Hmm. Holy crap, it was only, it was two hours, so it didn't feel like anything at all. Well, I mean, yeah, we that did... happens when you're stressed out. Well, you did get knocked out, right? So maybe that could be the reason. Because, like, I felt really groggy. -y. Lost someone into that room. Yeah, sometimes I, I heard some adventurers just kind of like conk out immediately you, because of all the strain strain they put on the body. Do you need some anti melatonin? Uh, no. To wake up. Fine. Okay. But that's very odd. It's, it's why, odd does it, why does it feel like my wife's calling for me? I. What did it, what does she mean by that? Maybe, um, maybe the wife figured out that he was cheating. I can check oh, if no. someone casted something on you if you wish. No, he'll be fine. I think. Well, I think is not enough convincing for me, really. I really worry about you. <sighs> okay, Toko sits down his seat and he does like a soul scan. Hey, what? He he does like a self scan for like magic. So scan Arcana. I will. Oof. I, I, am I able to help him? Because I want. I want to do. You can it help. Well. Yeah. Right. Tell me do what you want. Roll roll advantage, or do you want me to roll? Uh, I got seven. Oh, oh. you guys get fourteen. Fourteen. Uh, you don't know because okay. of certain things. I'll tell you next time. Right. Yeah, yeah, but yeah. you wouldn't know. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, he kind of like looks over and he's like, "No, I don't see anything. Unless you, unless we want to take fifteen minutes, I could find out." But it's really up to you. If you you're concerned enough for it, I'm fine waiting fifteen minutes. But otherwise, mm -hmm. I can keep going if you want. We could always just ask Catch, like Do what's we... on the ship too. He's been mm -hmm. there the longest, right? Mm -hmm. It could have been something with the room. We could ask Sketch or Rashira. Actually, that's a good point. Uh, Toko will like start walking towards back to the room, and he's just gonna like take a look at the area. Hey, <laughs> we just walk in. Hey, Rashira, is that room fucked up? <laughs> hey, yo, I just wanna know my homeboy is all right. Yo, yo, yeah, dig. Look, for my boy, for my boy. <laughs> um, Ain't no do nothing wrong. <laughs> the room is very normal. If you check out the other rooms, they're basically identical, except for this one's obviously, you know, tilted a bit. And smaller. Uh, do I know what kind of plants right here? Uh, fucking move. Those are just that. flowers. <laughs> don't ask me what kind, but like, normal has flowers that don't really, you know, hurt people. <laughs> hmm, okay. Uh, the room looks normal. I don't really see anything out, in the, out the usual. I could detect magic. Mm -hmm. Um, yes, if we, if we want to wait some time here instead of walking around, so we could always call Jeticus as well, um, right, I think? We have remains of that, um, Sending Stone. Hmm. Yeah, we still have that Sending Stone. True, but I think we should probably at least take a look around while we find, try and wait for the Sending Stone. Fair enough. I'm, I'm saying so, while someone is making the call, we could go and do other things. So are we like parked or like where are we? Basha is about to tell you guys you're parked. So anything else? I'm good. Right. I'm good. Basha will come. Meat bags. We've landed. Welcome to the city of blades. Well, thank oh, you. Thank be. you, Bay. Interesting. Thanks. I didn't prepare our city of place map because I'm gonna kill myself if I do, but uh That's I'll basically we're gonna use my favorite thing, uh Fear of mind. Imagination. Landing at the port, the party finds itself in the city of blades, which is 
for perspective, generally like an ordinary kingdom as a city, even though it doesn't have a king. It's like what's called a city of like large walls and defenses, using its natural formation, like being built on a plateau to, I guess, you know, give itself a very fucking defensive edge. Which makes pretty much makes sense of like why this place has been attacked compared to Sister City, Mercusius, because that's, you know, fucking near the docks. Uh, for you guys, you guys all know that the city is the home for gladiators and veterans alike, who have, I guess, you know, been fighting, been, you know, it's called doing shit like fighting ever since the Uprising War. At least that's what's been told. It's considered to be a sort of laid back town, right? Even though it's a city of adventures, like adventures and warriors, people also are very, what's called, chilly, cheery and jolly in this place. They celebrate their culture, you know, and have frequent, what's called, like local, t local tourneys in, you know, combat or eating, like eating contests, basically anything. They're a very, uh, they're a very, what's called, relaxed type of people. Paved roads and buildings basically fill the city within its main walls as you guys uh, step out of the airship. I would like to detect the buggy shield. Try detect to. the buggy shield. Uh, is it near five miles? I'd say yeah. It's yeah, you, you detect it, which is surprising. It's uh, I'd say what's called west. Yeah, west from where you guys are. Uh, did you get anything, Giuseppe? Yeah, he's west, and he's pretty close. How far away did you say it was? Around like three miles. Around three miles. Well then, let's not waste any time. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, so let's we... begin walking with Giuseppe's uh, GPS in his head. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> and uh, Toko will be helping like tracking with it by just kind of like... <laughs> He's trying to smell the herbs and spices. <laughs> uh, perception check. Okay. You better start floating towards the scent. <laughs> it's kind of he's... funny. It's kind of like somewhat spread it around. So it's very hard to like, I guess, detect one, you know, source of it. Telego, I can't believe he's spreading his, his herbs everywhere. <laughs> he's like, like a like plant. Sniff, sniff of the ground and he's like, salt, pepper, paprika. Sporty? Human? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, does another- does a 12 serve in spice? When was this? Uh, he did tell me this. <laughs> no. Uh, I like no baby. <laughs> uh, did he sell a new restaurant here? That'd be interesting, I guess. It makes sense. Busy place. Lots of people for customers. But, why would he- As you say that, you do see some, I guess, like, open stands, like, Open food stands, which, you know, surprisingly, also selling chicken. But do they have, uh, <laughs> but do they have their level herbs and spices? You don't know that. You're not close <laughs> enough to fucking sniff. Unless you want to, like, go up to the stand, stand and sniff that shit, like, right in front of them. <laughs> <laughs> Put your nose over the the bubbly brew of the oil. No, 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 <laughs> no, 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 just grab. No, walks up to the stall, place your hand on one of the chicken, raises up to your nose, take a deep whiff. Nah, just saying that. Throws it on the ground, keeps walking. <laughs> no, <laughs> no, no, he, no, Toko's not <laughs> doing that. I hope he sneezes to one of them. <laughs> <laughs> it's uh, like Billy from the Grim Adventures of Billy and Mandy. <laughs> oh. In your your big ass nose. And you're like... <laughs> uh, but no, Toko's just he's just as he's sniffing the air and like just trying to get an idea of like, okay, where's the herb and spice is coming from? <laughs> it's hard um, to tell. You can't locate with that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, I do have a question from being like from the heart of. Uh, mm -hmm. Would would I have gone to the city of Blade anyway? And if so, could I have known like? Or, or try to roll like history to know places that um Jadakus might go like more you than don't major know public is well enough to yeah, really I, I, that. yeah i just mean like uh like the public bars like knowing where they are and then like trying to lower it down because we know he's three miles in the western direction bars are pretty frequent here but pretty thankfully yeah. it's like three-ish miles so going west i'd say you're near uh, let me check in the notes I have for this shit. Probably no and... traffic is he probably make like some little hole in the wall kind of shop. It's very close to a butchery, which I guess you know, fitting, right? 
<laughs> yes, that would uh, yeah that would make sense for Jack. Because if he has a if he has a shop set up somewhere, then he would need to get a source of chicken. So butchery would be a good area to do it. I'm, but I'm probably just oh sorry. Uh, I'm probably just yeah, sorry. Mitchell casting it over and over. Yeah, yeah. So we just updated info. Yeah, we can we can help you uh, with like narrowing it down as you do it. And I guess let's see. I do know, like, hmm, perhaps you might be near a venturing guild. I don't know. Hmm. Well, but it's probably not going to be so upkept because you know he's always up and about, right? Well, yeah. But then again, he might have people <laughs> working there. I'm not saying he owns one, but he could just be at one. He could. We never asked him. Hmm. True. And I guess if not that, he'd probably be in a fighting ring. <laughs> though I don't I really... Those those are common here. Yeah, though I don't really see that happening the case, considering what happened to Brioche. Mm -hmm. Actually, no, I think but it could be the case if he's trying to have a death wish. Well, I guess we'll just have to find out. Yeah. So, Eventually, where to? You, you guys do end up near in a, what's called a tavern or a bar. Honestly, it's more of, Yeah, it's a tavern, but it's very fucking small. And it seems like Jack is in here. And this Isn't is or is? I'll switch the map. So, uh, this is the place, Giuseppe? Is, that's where the tracking is? Yeah. yeah, I mean, at least the bug is here, not necessarily him. Oh, well, it's probably oh, with <laughs> the <that> name. <laughs> this is a this small ass tavern. This, this small is ass tavern. Really small. Yeah. So real for that, honestly. Mm -hmm. Well, if the bug, <laughs> well, if the bug shield's here, then chances are we'll find something. Actually, he may have sold it, but. I, I don't know. Let's find out. Uh, I shall head in. The inside. You should probably go in first. He he's always kind of liked you the most. Uh, Toko walks in the door. Does he get hit with a a wave of herbs and spices? Yeah. <laughs> no, he's here, all right. And you see these people, basically what's called eating food. Is it chicken? It's chicken. How did he set it up so fast? We are hardly gone a week. That's People what I'm saying. He probably had this you. shop a long time ago. Uh, Togo's just like, I'm looking around and taking the surroundings. It's not very filled. Like, this is like the actual amount of people. You, uh, it's like normal commoners and what's called. There's this one, like, this one figure that's like the most, like, Distinguished, essentially. Or doing yellow. I don't have that map prepared, but it's basically the up. It's basically the upstairs I, for I guess the bedrooms. I'm not going upstairs. Nick's just pointing at me. <laughs> okay, I'm pointing at him, and then I'm pointing at the toilet. <laughs> oh, I thought you were going upstairs. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, that's all I can glean from this area. Mm. Not what's called. Not very uh big. Not very uh bombastic as someone like Chadicus would really do. Uh, Togo doesn't really say anything. His mind's just like, this is just, I, I mean, yes, he's here undeniably, or at least he would be here, but this doesn't seem like Chatticus. This is a rather, I guess, dull place. He doesn't say anything. And family member, maybe? Well, no, no this is Togo's inner monologue. Oh, okay. Yeah. Uh, Togo. I like he's talking out loud. <laughs> Togo goes up to this fellow and he's like, um, excuse me, if you have a minute, um, do you, what is it? Do you know of a uh, Chatticus? Is he here? Oh, he's my old adventuring partner. Um, where can we find him? Here, we want to Oh, talk he's here him. right now. He's working on the, well, he's running the tavern. Okay. Uh, I assume he's in the kitchen then? He's in the kitchen. Okay. Thank you. 
Uh, I assumed kitchen's like right here, so it's open right here. Yeah, Toko. Oh my god. He pokes his head through, and he and then like he pokes his head through, closes the door, or like actually no, okay, There's no door. <laughs> he he like okay, sorry. He walks in and and gets to the entrance, sees Chagas, turns to everyone else, and just kind of says like stay here, and then he's just gonna like kind of walk up, up behind Chagas, and then he's gonna say and he's just gonna recite the herbs and spices. Either, before you do that, you'll be like, here's be like, oh, welcome to a small ass tavern. You want room? Because, oh, it's you. He turns around seeing you. Yeah. Hey, Jack, I guess. Fuck you, what? Well, we came in to check up on you first, for the most, after okay, that. Hey, fuck off. You're not, you're not sanitized. Get the fuck away from me. Get the oh. fuck out of the kitchen, first of all. All right, hold on. Let me sanitize myself. No, I meant, fuck it, move. <laughs> Get out of here. I wanted to know what you were up to. You uh, just seemed to disappear into the city and... Well, don't work in my old job. You know, my client is dead, so... Yeah, don't have work. Oh. Well... We're going out to take on the job that we had. And not only that, but... We plan to get vengeance on... The Silent Knight. Good luck. You want a room or something? Like I'll give you a discount, but you know, if that's if you're asking more from me, I'm I'm, I'm done. That's fair enough. Um, do you? Where's Brios? I think <clears throat> I gave his body with uh, his family. I see. Oh god, wait. Did Emily hear that? Because <laughs> I don't think we told her. No, you told her. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, yeah, I was making that noise now. Just goes to comfort her and hug at the same time. If you guys want. You know, food to pack. I can do that for you, but please don't fucking make me do more than I already did. No, I won't. That would All be right. really cruel. I just wanted to know what you were up to. Seems like you're alright. Um, Good day. Yeah. Good day. And on your restaurant business, so. Uh... Whatever you do. You go back to smoking, cooking. Unless anyone else wants to say anything. Uh, Toko's going to just kind of uh, say, Live well, old friend. And then he's just going to leave. Ooh, what's Navi going to do? I Might think it's like, you can go get something to do, Nick. Oh, I mean, if you want to go say it first. <laughs> uh, I wouldn't say anything to chat because... But like as he fully like leaves back into the kitchen, he will look as the party is like they're about to leave and he goes I would say something, but my words would mean nothing to him. So I don't think it's worth it if I say anything at all. That's fine. Uh can just have you like speak up. Yeah, sure. Go ahead. Okay. He's like, remember when you said that you were God? He doesn't respond. Yeah. Well, I after you said that, I said that I wouldn't mind being the God. Yeah. You need to get back in that mindset. Who cares? You can do anything. I'm gonna be a God because I decided I'm gonna be. So just do that. Who cares? Okay, I know what happened is awful. But he still can do the impossible. He saved you from the night. No one else could do that. All right? He decided he wanted to do something, so he did it. Nothing more complicated than that. Okay, don't go acting like you have to... Just do what you want to do, okay? Pursue your dream. Don't let anything else stop you. If you want to be a god, be a god. 
That's all I'm gonna say. Ooh, you saved it. <laughs> I was gonna ask you, like, make a persuasion check to see how badly Chad starts fighting you. <laughs> Good job. Weird. But in the end, he doesn't really say anything to you. After he, just, he uh, like, still cooks. Uh, after Giuseppe fully finishes his like expunge, uh, Naved will put his hand on his shoulder and goes. We we should leave him. Let him find that, his own path again. If that's actually what he wants to do, then I'm fine with that. Actually, I was about to say the same sentiment as well. People break, and it is up to them to find their pieces again. Jadicus chooses to leave them on the ground to rot away. That is his own fault. But he is a strong man. In time, he'll remember to clean up after himself. Let him have this moment for now. That will kind of like kind of shuffle on over a little bit. <laughs> Well, while you were saying all that, and we'll kind of like get to over here, I'm like a little bit of like earshot to, of him. And then he say, <laughs> Well, you know, the, certainly some old man didn't have to go do all that and, and such. Yeah. Kind of a shame how he kind of lost his little bit of, of a flame, but if that's what he wants to do, then that's all he got, then. I. I don't think bitterness is going to solve our problems today. Oh no, it's not implied as that. It's more so of... What he sacrificed. I thank mm -hmm. for that. Giuseppe is going to go up to the bathroom door and hang a flyer on it for the magic shop. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> I just fully imagine we're having this emotional moment when you hear the fucking like hammer and nail just a. No, oh, it sticks to it magically. <laughs> it sticks magically. It's like a what's it called uh, stick like I like how tape sounds. It's magic glue. It sounds like tape, which is still very loud. <laughs> okay. After a sigh, he just goes, "Let's let's go." And then on the poster, I want to write like yeah. Uh, fuck you. <laughs> fuck you, bitch. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Uh, you my bitch. <laughs> like, uh, you're welcome to become a shovel knight if you want. Do whatever you truly want to do. And that's it. The name is still pending. <laughs> you're putting that down, or are you, are you just so, so defying shovel knight? <laughs> <laughs> after after Giuseppe leaves, she's gonna put a like parentheses pending. <laughs> uh, while as I watch uh, Dell do that, uh, I walk up and I put TM on the on the top. <laughs> <Very fucking. laughs> I got one okay. last thing. While you guys walk out, <laughs> I can leave. I was gonna go up to the doorway and just kind of like peek her head and say. Thank you again. If not for you, you would not have started this type of fire, at least. I've repaid the debt one day. Maybe you'll be there with us, maybe not. Goodbye. You're quite away with words. Badass. Get the fuck out of the way! <laughs> so barely through. <laughs> uh, Toko, like... to, he's just he's just leaning across in the against the wall of side slows. I, I think we're done here, Toko.
Is he sleeping? Or is he sad? I'm sad now. Until <laughs> Gold turns to Navid and then starts walking. His eyes are still closed, but he opens them after like a second or two. He's just thinking. Don't worry, hon. Mm -hmm. Please. Do your best to keep your head up. Where would we be without a smile like that? And then we walk back to the airship. Are leading them there? Yeah. Yeah! <laughs> sure, I'll do that. Kirby, hey, yeah. one last little yeah. thing. <laughs> like a little thing. note right here. I'm gonna tell the ship for Sophia. There's a note that she left behind. It says fucking pussy. <laughs> <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why are, why are we <laughs> why are we tormenting him so much when he decided to retire? It's so fucking funny too. Because like... the reason this is happening is because Dell's chaotic neutral. <laughs> I want I want to get that fire back into him. <laughs> Gotta make him angry. <laughs> That's not gonna help. <laughs> you need the context. context clues, but that'll that'll be that's a plot line later. <laughs> the next villain. Like, oh I my hope. god, why would you do that? Ain't no way. <laughs> god, I hope him. not. Oh, uh, Navi, get out of the fucking bedroom. Wait, I can't move? Oh, this side, this side is bugged. You didn't, you didn't work. activate it. I know, but like, I'm trying to move him, right? We are- oh. I am moved. I am on the top deck. Yeah, I know, yeah. you weren't. You are what's called oh, glitching okay. it. <laughs> Trumpet! Without any success, the party makes their way back to the airship, and it's- it's the uh, sunset now. The estimated travel to Afar is four hours around night. Hey. Well, that was a bit of a bust. So it's a shame to see someone retire. Mm -hmm. Especially. To I retire. don't blame him. I was thinking of retiring myself, but still got some stuff to do. And he just glances at Navid. He smirks. Whatever keeps that fire going. Well, there's only the one thing we can do now, and that is to push forward. Mm -hmm. For Brio's sake, and for the one who cannot continue. Mm -hmm. We must push when others cannot. Uh, as Toko, Toko's gonna start, like, walking towards, like, the, uh, front of the ship, and as he's doing, he, so he's gonna try and, like, try and create a, uh, ice fluid again. Ice? Yes. Uh, our Kana check. Let's see how good this fluid is. Yay! It actually works! It's functioning! And it's made of ice. Yes, oh. uh, as he's gonna walking, he's just... He's walking slowly, but surely just doing it. And then when he gets to like right about there, if my computer work, uh, you you will start playing a song. Uh, roll performance. Yes. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> it's. I don't know. Maybe you're holding back emotions. Maybe you know, like, or maybe your throat just sucks from you know. You did smell a lot of chicken and herbs, so it could be a multitude of things, but your playing right now isn't at the best. Or it could also be your drowsy, because you're certainly drowsy again. Hmm. Like, Toko, like, does, I, I assume he does, like, 12, actually, no, he does, like, 32 notes before he just kind of, like, pauses and just kind of lowers it, and he's just like, yeah. Thought so, and he, and then he just chucks the fluid into the water and walks back. <laughs> wait, I'll, I'll get it. Wait, wait no, 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 wait, no, wait. No, no, no. <laughs> oh right, we're up in the sky now. Um, what? And so uh, Togo's are... just hey, Togo's hanging straight to bed again. Would anyone be interested in a game of cards? Um, what are we playing then? Uh, I don't know. This game of cards. Out. 
I have a deck. Anyone have games? I could give you an old hard Oki and Gamble game. How about an old one I knew? 52 pickup. Can I, I do sky this fishing? Is a setup for something. <laughs> sky fishing? Oh man, I tried that too. Apparently, you can't really catch birds with anything. You gotta have to take a feed. <laughs> <laughs> it's like hotter, right? I was like, oh, can I go sky fishing? <laughs> what? I don't really think I can. So, the best you can really do is just shoot them out of the air and then catch them. But that's gonna kill them. Flying fish? There's no flying. Not, not in this height. <laughs> For context, you're like uh, around what's called not thousand, but like eight hundred feet up in the air. So yeah, then I don't think fish can really, I guess, fly up that fucking far. <laughs> fly <laughs> fishing, but I guess I'll just join the crew it. then if I can't catch anything. Do what's called. Do take note that our long rest here is four hours. So if you have any spell slots uh, wasted, feel free to sleep in. All right, I'll burn all my spell slots. <laughs> uh, Naveed, what we can do is that we can play uh, an old game I used to like to play. It's called uh, a parent slap. What? <laughs> I, an old I, parent slap? I, my parents? What, what does the game consist of? Uh, so we all take turns in rotation and putting down a, a card face down, or face up, actually. And then uh, mm -hmm. if there's like a pair of uh, two, uh, you slap it, you take the entire deck, right? Uh, mm. Winner takes... No, the winner is uh, the most with the, the most cards. It's Egyptian war. Is anyone joining? Uh, is someone gonna sleep? Just make sure because that's uh, something I've been. Uh, Tolko's. I know Tolko's yeah. sleeping, but anyone else is like, uh, trying to no. sleep you know? Probably yeah. after slapping for so long, yeah. yeah. I will. I, we will. I, I will be still taking a long rest, but he was just like playing a card game to pass. Yeah, he'll the be time. playing cards. Like anyone actually physically going to like nap as a character. That's what I'm asking. What's that? Elven yeah. Ratius. Can't be Ratius. Oh, elves can't, so, uh... Let's wait. Uh... <laughs> uh... Uh... Yeah, you guys are good. Uh... 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 Oh, did you read the message, Kirby? Spells. Shoot me a message. Yeah. I'm gonna have some wait. fun. I can't wait to oh, yeah. counterspell someone because of my funny spells of the mark. You definitely are gonna yeah. get Oh, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Me when I say a baby and I'm about to punt them. <laughs> They're set up for their field goal. <laughs> <laughs> so you guys are gonna be playing cards? Yeah. yeah or... Alright, we'll switch over then. Give me a bit. You guys can roleplay amongst yourselves. Fuck off. Uh, oh, just yeah. just to let you know, Dell slaps hard as fuck. <laughs> so what does this game consist of? Uh, so the the face cards have their the different type. The next person. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just gonna have that for next time. <laughs> uh, it, it includes the rules of like, oh, face cards. It, the next person over has to draw that many, or they don't. You take all the deck. Yada yada yada. Uh, rules explain. Uh. And if you get if you get one in between, like let's say you put this one here, and then you have one uh, of a different one, and then the same one on top of the pair from before, mm -hmm. you can still slap that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Ready to play? <laughs> and mind you, this okay. So uh, IRL encounter. I had a friend in high school that I used to play this a lot with her. Uh, so many times, she would slap the fuck out of my hand. <laughs> Because it would, it would be, always be a race, because if you see it, you can just smack it, right? i put my hand down, I'd get it first, and she was just like, fucking... <laughs> just goes ham. <laughs> oh, small comment, but I kind of like what's going cool. I like the party's a color scheme now. We're actually the edgiest party, like, look at it. Like, gray, white, you know, black. Uh, black, 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 <laughs> blue, black white, I didn't know that was black. a color. <laughs> and, yeah. <laughs> Once Durkis gets proper art, you know. <laughs> God, this will be like the cool. We'll be fucking what's called like emo. Like we're all like what's called black theme. I love it. We're the cool. All right, we're ready to cool play? <laughs> yeah, sure, whatever. All right, you guys can play and uh, Tolko drifts off to <laughs> funny sleep. I 
I would like to fully imagine in the middle of this game, like, Neved not being, like, all that fast and playing it. He keeps, like, missing the slap parts, but then, like, the one time he hits you, it just fucking, like, shatters your hand. <laughs> <laughs> it's, like, it's, like, the most pain you ever experience in the slap. The one time he gets you every time he plays the game, loses every other time. <laughs> <laughs> the cartoon animated hand like <laughs> with the heartbeat just like swelling red <laughs> <laughs> i think i think that's what like um delgis hit <laughs> she'll do it back in kind don't worry yep. she got you she got you <laughs> yeah. whoa definitely emelyn <laughs> yeah so it's all goes shipping out of his mind yeah you open your eyes you're on the ground you prone you actually fuck you you're on the ground bitch you Open your eyes, and you're in a... You don't know where you are. Oh, what? Eyes right now. Oh. Where? Uh, hallucinations. There's... You don't need to ask those questions. Just... You need to get up. Come on. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna get up. You get up, and they're gonna look around? Uh, yes, I'm gonna get my bearings. <clears throat> no time. Alright, opening your eyes, Tolko, you're definitely in a strange snowy landscape, which is unfamiliar to you, but the moment you look up in the sky, here's the weird part. You see the fucking planet. What? Alongside the void of the, uh, void of the stars. Or what people call here the astral sea. What? Oh. He's on the moon. This... This is that... This is the world I'm in? Huh. Ooh. What the? Is we can ask questions later. Figure out what we are doing. Where we are. Where are the others? Uh. Okay. Okay. Get your head together. What's the first thing we need to do? Uh, okay. We need to figure out, out what is around here. What can I eat? What can, no. I mean, yes, but... My head. Where am I? Damn, you're tripping balls to look out. <laughs> but you do hear footsteps. <laughs> uh, from what direction? Uh, here. Uh, then Toko will look that direction. And not only that, he's just, oh. he's actually going to kind of like, get to a kind of, I guess, slightly obscure spot. Obscure spot. <laughs> yeah, he, he's fucking tripping balls. <laughs> Eventually a figure shows up. One winged and shit. I think you know who it is. Uh... <laughs> is that <Wolf>? Yeah. <laughs> Holy uh shit. For context, Wait. this is what they look like uh, via character artwork. It's very blurry, but show your layers. Oh, is it? Oh, no. Has Tolko's wife come to smack him down? Oh, no. She has the divorce papers, doesn't she? <laughs> <laughs> That's why I was laughing so much. I was like, oh, fuck. <laughs> divorce papers. Divorce and my, deportation uh, papers. My, no! My, my dear, I've gone to enough strength to say a few words to you, and only a few words. I want to break up. <laughs> <laughs> and then he gets fucking um, Doctor Strange out of body experience <laughs> ripped back into his original body. Uh, Toko kind of sees the fairy, and he's like, Honey? And he, like, he starts, like, walking forward. Uh, Kagoe, is that you? She nods. Still, or what's called hand on her face. Like, uh, what, okay, uh, describe the hand on the face. Is it like a shock face? Is it like a, a she's like, she's got like has a face underneath her it's, chin? It's a general, what's called, it's a general, like, uh, stoic, like, you know, not really emotional face, but it's like that she usually holds, essentially. Uh, uh, Toko. Uh, like, at first he starts, and then he just, he like, he picks up his pace, and he's just like, it's been so long. Uh, I don't even know what to say. 
And then Toko just like hugs her. That's really gay. She hugs back. <laughs> pretty straight. Yeah. Huh? <laughs> He's the puppeteer. That's why he's hugging the last. God. <laughs> <laughs> that's why you're not speaking as it. I knew it. I knew it. You know this. Talk the lore, bro. I can't fucking say it. <laughs> uh. How did you find me? She ponders, and then she speaks up. It took a while. Oh, well, I'm glad you're here. Interestingly enough, it took a while is not a question. Toko and... Take note of it! Toko and stay. <laughs> uh... It's been a while. I'm glad to hear, though. I... It'll be sparked, but we'll see each other more often. Yeah, I imagine so. I've been in, well, this new world. It's quite interesting, I must say. But we can talk about that when I'm home. Um, how's everyone back home? Not and them? She nods, giving like the affirmative. Look. They're they're good. <laughs> that's good. So they didn't, and that's good. I I'm gonna try and do my best to make it back home, no matter what it takes. I don't know how long it'll be, but I'll be there eventually. She smiles at you still let's go holding her withholding her words and from I guess like her chest pocket she hands you something. A flower. The same thing you gave that fucking woman. You <laughs> But it's big But it's bigger and much beautiful. <laughs> right? Oh, shit. Food, uh... What? <laughs> but... Sorry. <laughs> I'll put it in your fucking inventory. Hold uh, on. Can we just smite Nick out of existence? I maybe? might, I might, I want to. That's why I'm, uh, <laughs> I'm doing the bunny! <laughs> can't fucking wait. Goddamn. But you have a new item in your inventory, and... You see, I guess, the area, right? The area around you? It was, what's it called? It, it was unfamiliar, and even now it still is, but... It slowly coalesces into, uh... The home you have, the place of the undying. Those who don't die, those who aren't tarnished by a quote unquote, what's the word? Quote unquote impurity. Yeah. Turns back to you in a little. Uh, Toko is speaking early in here. Um, thanks. I. I will. I. I want to make it known. Just again, even if I don't make it. If I were to die in this new world. From here to now and eternity beyond, I love you so much. She smiles back and uh, eventually everything fades into white as uh, your dream seems to end. Uh, Toko, when he comes, the tears are flowing out of his eyes, even he's still asleep currently. Mm -hmm. We're back in the cloud gazer where the gang are uh, playing cards. <laughs> You're awake now though. And you're feeling refreshed, funnily enough, which is very different from that, what's called strange, uh... That strange, I guess, what's called... What's the word? Like, atrophy? That you encounter? Uh, I think that's fatigue? Yeah, fatigue. Fatigue. Yeah. A strange fatigue that, like, hit you. The wave of fatigue that hit you. There we go! Don't, don't high five yourself after fucking up. <laughs> no. Listen, English is my second language. Yeah. Uh, uh at atrophy is the term of, like... Wasting away, or like, yeah, you're wasting away, bang. old man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Why are you shooting shit as a yellow? What the fuck? Not him. I'm at glass, but yeah, you're up. You're awoken. Yeah, Toko's just sitting there. He's had. He's sitting in the bed. He has the rose in his hands, and he's just he's just bawling. And by bawling, I mean crying. Is in. it a silent cloud uh, crying, or is it like... It's like, I guess Emlyn can probably pick up on it, maybe. But he, he's just... Hey. Yeah, he picks... Yeah, she can hear it. 
Um, uh, um, uh, uh, uh. She tugs Del. <laughs> yeah? It fucking slaps in Naveed's hand. <laughs> no, <stop>! <laughs> <laughs> oh! Fuck! Why you gotta be faster I, I, than that? Come on! I thought the game was buzzed! The, the... <laughs> What are you talking about? No, we're still going! It seems like there was a, a family matter at hand. Oh, okay, what's up, Emily? <laughs> She'll whisper on your big ass ears. Mr. Tolik was crying. Mm. Can you fix it? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if I can fix it, but I can certainly go check up on him. Me too. Good you too, Nubby. You're like, you're like, uh... Honestly, you're not very soft. But you're mm -hmm. kind. No, don't, don't have Nubby check up on Tolikal. <laughs> you don't want to too, then, Durkis? You're, you're also not soft. I you're, do not feel like I, you now, I can do that. He will push just in his chair. Well, it seems we are all going there. Might as well. Uh, fine. All right, uh, the door. <laughs> Emily, no, we go, we go quiet. Uh. Holoko, this is an intervention. <laughs> no crying allowed. Jesus fucking hell. <laughs> okay. Is that what you actually say? You just make it a bit. No, that was a bit. Okay, okay, okay. Oh god. <laughs> Holy shit. What, the fuck? Uh, what happened? Is it Chaticus? Uh, when uh, Emily, when you guys enter in, like Toko will, will kind of like takes a pause when he's crying, but like. He he can he's like, uh, yeah, hi. Well, yeah, it's a Tolico, and you have a bad dream. Uh, Tolico, he's still holding the rose in his hands, like very, I guess, like a very warm. It, wait, it's a warm hold. Wait, wait, did the rose carry over from Dreamland? The rose carry over. Okay. Where did you get that rose? <laughs> I think I will go over and like put a hand on him, like just comfort at least. You, my wife. I saw her. Have you talked? Oh, and this is what she get me. Come, I hope. I love it. I want to go back home, but be strong. I can do this. Yeah. She most likely misses you too. Don't worry, we'll we'll find a way of getting you back. Your warmth, your touch. I can't wait. And then, like, he starts, like, wiping his tears off a bit. Um, here you go. Uh, he hands him a handkerchief. Uh, he takes it, starts wiping it. Mm -hmm. She has given you a gift. Something to think forward away. to. After so long, I've tried contacting her. Mm -hmm. Every night. Every night. Our persistence has paid off. And now, she's said we reach. What did she give you? Uh, Toko kind of like, in one hand, he like grabs it and he's holding it. She gave me my, well, one of. One of the gifts I gave her. When we got married. Hmm. Are you showing it off? I'll put it in voice chat. Yeah, he, yeah, he is. Uh, I'll yeah, put he... in cogs to show what Tolko's holding. Yeah. It's... It is very beautiful. It's a flower of this caliber. It's a rose made of ice. Does Does it need to stay cool? No. I made it so that's. It would never break, never melt. What is good? And 
specifically this one is what part of the the bouquet I gift her at her wedding. Mm. Mm -hmm. And Toko's gonna like hold it up to his eye. I he's like, even now I can s still see the memories of it. <laughs> I can see her time together in this rose. I I will make it back home. Yes. You will. You will. We all will. I hope. Yes. We will all make our way back home. Wherever that may be. Then, yeah. And then uh yeah. Toko is going to I he's gonna he's gonna like kinda like stick it so, like somewhere on his body that is visible. Oh yeah, put it like a lapel. Yeah, kind of like that. I was just about to say that. Or like a... Or like he a... trippy! Or... What the fuck? Why is he so drippy now? Oh yeah, we just wanted to check up on you. I if... appreciate it. If you're not too tired, do you mind joining us? Sure, in a bit. <laughs> Take all the time yes. you need. I pat him on the shoulder a bit. Let's go. Oh. You long rested. Oh no, you short rest, so your slap damage is fine. I believe. I believe that is all good then. In time, we will have our. Also, uh, how long will it take to attune to this? Uh, you're attuned to it already. Let's fucking go. Okay. Uh, I got marriage buff already. Gish, what are on. you doing here? Oh, uh, sorry. Am I, am I? What's going? Like, are you guys good? No one interrupts again. We're good. We're um, just fine. We're here, but two things, so you know, you can kind of gear up. We're above a battlefield, so if you're me, you want to try out using those scrolls. Oh wait, we're battlefield. Mm -hmm. Who's and fighting? They look like Phoenicians, which I assume are the red hot wings that y'all are going to deal with or help. And I don't know the other people, unfortunately. We oh, will those Gizmos people, right? Is that what they are? I couldn't really tell by what their armor looked like. No, that's what we were briefed on. Yeah. Or maybe it's something else. I don't know. I don't really know, so, you know. Hmm. How do you guys want to land? You want to land, like, somewhere nearby, or do you want to just... Go for it and jump. Hmm. We could land mid battle and essentially aid the aid them, and then whoever else is still alive, we can get more first hand information from them. I say we just jump. Y'all jumping? Where are we jump? dropping, boys? We'll land nearby. I'll fire a flare and. Uh... I think you guys will see it, and hopefully you'll deal with them so they don't spot the flare and hit us instead. <laughs> well, I like right. to see them try beating us in Basia. Oh shit, we're we're going in uh, directly to a fight. Yeah, I guess so. You're jumping out the battle bus. <laughs> let me go. Let me go get my armor. Let's go, thank bus driver. Catch, keep keep watch of our our, our decks here. I want to continue yes, our game afterwards. So was that just a short rest? That's a long rest. Long okay. rest. I can take a long rest. It's a funny hard oak, uh, funny hard oak wood. Uh, four hours. Sleep. Hard oak wood is allows us to, to photosynthesize. It means that the travel is really fucking fast. Even though you're what's called it's a shitty merchant ship. Or cargo ship, rather. A shitty cargo ship turned into a... Uh, I don't know what this is. <laughs> Adventure ship. For cheap people. But yeah, gather a party into the deck. Okay. Uh, okay. Lights, so I can fucking see everything. Go. Are you alright, Mr. Toloko? Uh, Toloko oh, oh, says yes, but is in Nerulean, so... <laughs> I don't know what that means. Oh, uh, hope... my apologies, sorry. Uh, yes, I'm fine. Okay. Actually, I feel. I feel. 
Togo like pauses for a second as he like clears his throat. I'm feeling great. You're saying that and like it sounds scary, but I'm not sure if it's like you're feeling great, great, or you know you're. He, he's yeah. motivated. He's motivated, and he's. I am motivated. Yeah, he's motivated. He's a mover and a shaker. Got that thug kicker. <laughs> got that thug in him. And a, and a candle. Got that dog in him. Are you missing anyone? Oh, we have. I don't know how you're getting down. Uh. <laughs> I I land with the uh, buttercup. <laughs> Break He's his so ankles. You summon him. Instead. No, what's yeah. the, what you do instead is uh, you get on top of buttercup, pray you don't fall off. You slow fall buttercup, and you'd be fine as well. Okay. Because let's see, slow fall targets five people, including yourself, right? Yep. Very cool. So. Yeah. Yeah, just enough. Just enough. I just have to like enough. resummon him on the ground over there. <laughs> oh, shit. You can't really. Re That's ten minutes, and I kind of want you to play with your mount. So. Um, okay. You just have the mount break its legs so you don't take any fall damage. Yeah. That's what happens in Tears of the Kingdom. You ride a horse off a cliff, and then they die, and then you don't take any damage. It's funny. <laughs> it's happened to me way too many times. I hate it. <laughs> Listen, I guess someone shouldn't be falling. Trash. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> Let me get the map. <clears throat> uh, eventually, you guys fall. And is it, who's casting like spells, like the uh, feather fall? Is it scroll or is it unity? I mean, I can cast. A, I, I can use the scroll. Yeah, I think it so might be better if we use the scroll. Yeah. Okay, I'll use the scroll then. You can use make more scroll. later. All right, yeah. everyone, we're heading out. Here, John. Out the battle buzz, uh, what's it called? Catch salutes you guys and you fall off. Eventually, uh, you guys land relatively well. So what's it called? Honestly, like your first time landing with Featherfall, pretty fucking good. And I'll scatter you guys here. Uh, here you guys are. Oh fucking <laughs> activate scene. Navid lands with a with a a grace implying that he had to do it many times. <laughs> Oops, I don't know why this happened. Let me just fix this. Oh. <laughs> That's them falling in. Weekend. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what the fuck? Oh no, you're really gonna th do this to us, Gary? Oh no. <laughs> oh god, fighting a cliff. Listen, I made these fuckers. So I got it. I know. <laughs> oh my god, Siostra. <laughs> but yeah, you're gonna what's called. You guys can, I guess, let me draw a line. Yeah, fuck. Uh, this is free draw, right? Yeah, anywhere here you can reposition. And then Holy let's call it. Tell me when you guys are ready to start combat. <laughs> All the way in. I'm All fucking roll up. Dargus is a frontliner. I, I, what do you expect? Well, you ran last time, so I, I mean, you know, it's been a while. Well, yeah, he ran because it was like his <laughs> mortal nemesis. <laughs> Which is Damn, really you're funny, putting salt in the wound. He had his reasons. Uh, for question: yeah. How high up is this one? I know, like the top says eighty feet. I'm assuming that's like the top of it, though. I'll say this is forty. Okay, then uh, Toko will be climbing up into the bush. To the bush. Yeah, that is a good job. Sniping. It's a good job, Sniping mate. Game in. Good job, mate. Go combat. Yay! You guys will have uh. Oh, well, let me let me roll these fuckers first, actually. And I'll add you guys into the initiative board. Nick, can you do me a favor in what's called deer combat as well? Since your your horse goes with you, so move that. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I got it. Uh, shark combat. There you go. Yeah. Okay, fuck off. Remove this one, and remove a uh, fucking. Remove renegade, remove renegade. Is there a way I can just like remove like it's called like the extra? Uh, no? uh, yeah, you can actually. Uh, do you go, that? you right click them, and then underneath it says remove combatant. combatant. Okay. I've been doing that. Mine like like just faster. <laughs> Normally, no, I don't. I do not know. I think because no. their their actor token isn't linked, it considers them two different beings, which means two different combats. That's why okay, you just keep it. them on outside. Yes. Like that. Yeah, I'll do that next time then. But yeah, because that's what roll. I do all the time. Emlyn will roll. <laughs> you roll subjugator. You roll. No, that's Dergus. I don't roll him. <laughs> oh, I I can. Right, I need to roll Dergus. Subduer, you roll a. Uh, you you roll a. Uh, <laughs> Holy shit! I rolled shit. What the fuck? 
Don't worry, you guys. Uh, you guys will be good. Since All right, who's who's an enemy? Who's an ally? Who are we? Who are we beating down? The oh, Phoenicians, fuck Phoenicians. obviously. That's true. Exactly. All my but homies ser- seriously, except for in this one moment, the Phoenicians are the good guys because they're the red hot, they're the red hot wings. I think their name is the red, red hot, hot chili, chili peppers. peppers. <laughs> <laughs> Same way, Honestly, Mike. why didn't Dart use that name? Damn it! Yeah, I think I I think the funny thing about that is that their signification could be a tattoo on their arm. <laughs> <laughs> it's a flaming chile. Okay, Emma will cast Hunter's Mark. Shit, Emma was just going in. And she'll target Subjugator this one. Let's shoot. That misses. That hits! <laughs> it's all damage. Oh, these guys will crumple easily. <laughs> oh no, you're, you're about to be found out. We, you're we, about to figure out, find we, out. We are currently fucking around and we are just about to find out. No. <sighs> Return. Subjugator so story. He's like, what? Fuck. He goes, uh. Hmm, no decide between you and Navid. Now noticing you guys, he'll say something to this mic that's actually what's going on. Unintelligible to the rest <laughs> of you guys. You, you hear the fucking fan or that now? From yeah. Star Wars. <laughs> Let me roll one D two. One is uh, Navi, two is Jarvis. Honestly, they'd go for the weaker one. Be funny. He can't sell. <laughs> yes, go for Navi. Uh, let's attack you. Oh uh, shit! <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I'm it's a... Oh no! Um, nope. That is. Oh, it's not. That is not happening. Plus, nice job. they have a fucking plus. Yes. Plus ten to hit. I made these guys a long time ago. Don't worry. I'll reroll damage then. See what happens. Okay, don't worry. Seven, you take seven instead, Navi. Okay. But worry a lot. You're you're welcome. He only uses his uh, extra attack. Attack again. <laughs> <laughs> right, that's that's my reaction. I can't, wait. Hold um, on. Yeah, I I can't cancel I, that. I take I take, yeah. I take thirteen damage. <laughs> That's really unlucky. I don't, I don't got anything for that. The, the, um, the dice decide you die. I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah, that's that's facts. That's yeah. That'll be enough. His turn. The V, your turn. All right. Um, I'm gonna as like the the fucking spear is in his stomach. He just goes, "Damn, you hit hard." Anyways, and he is going to snap his fingers and uh. Seeing the battlefield, see robots, and with robots come explode now. <laughs> nice shatter. That's uh, that's everyone in the series, right? Got yep. It. And they need to, they need to all make uh, Constitution saving throws, and they're not. They have robots, disadvantage. So. Yeah, uh, they're not actually robots, so... <laughs> are they actually just people, or what are they? Uh, now, you know they're people now. Okay. Right, so, so two of them fail, and they take... Sorry. That's, what, 20 damage? Yeah, only two of them fail and take 20 damage. Uh, the others take... The 10. And... Uh... Anything else? I think... That is it. That's my action. Uh, I'm good. Oh, I should. Oh, I need to remember next time. I should use the ball Rabo. He's the end of my turn. The ball. I'm good. <laughs> need to see someone over here. Uh, well, Tasha's turn. Hi, Tash. <laughs> Love you, buddy. I miss this guy, and I changed yeah. class too because fuck barbarian. So real. Oh, he's hitting himself. He just needs to clear these people out. <laughs> 23 fire damage. Uh, deck saves. One, two, three, four. Oh shit, you're oh, all fucking fail. dead. <laughs> fucking what? blows the people up. <laughs> and it's just as if they were left. And at this turn, he'll run up to this guy though. Fuck him. Fuck this guy specifically. Oh, my god, I hate these things. Seppi, your turn. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so do I know that if this guy is my enemy or not? Uh, uh, Red Hawkins are Phoenicians. This just casted a spell. He looks very Phoenician. <laughs> okay. 
Are we allowed to communicate? Yeah, you can communicate. I literally, I will, I will go. <laughs> Yo, big guys fucking up the guys we're fucking up. <laughs> Yo, brother, I'm gonna fuck them up too. Wait, <laughs> are you Phoenician? You know, you're uh, fuck, forgot the word, and then just happy stern. Okay, so I'm, I'm gonna... informing you that he's good. I'm gonna use my bag of tricks. Yeah, hey, yeah. Right. Right. I don't wanna kill myself. I have to Wait. upload these images. Uh, how do I? <laughs> I did like. Okay, so five. Wait, so that's is that the one I think? Is that the one where you can just pull out extra animals? Okay, yep. Yeah. Okay, that's okay. a panther. Panther. Okay, plutonium. Holy oh, shit! You, you rolled like one better once. Panther. I, I I remember in one campaign I played it was pretty busted because it was just extra actions for a single turn of investment. I'm pretty sure he gave that item to me too as uh, Arvis. Oh. Importing panther. What do you want that panther to do? Uh, I'm just gonna tell it. To attack the guys that look like robots. Robots? Sure thing. And uh, as I, yeah, as I spell it out, I say jungle. Or as a reference to the iconic <laughs> ELO song, Jungle. Oh, I thought you were making a League reference and I was going to feel horrible. Nah. Okay, we'll attack then. What is one attack? Oh, and that used my bonus action to Got command it. him. So yeah, that's my turn. Actually, no, I can marshal check. Marshall, I marshal go. check this guy. Uh... Oh, this is... Heck, uh, intelligence. Uh, what do you want to learn? Uh, uh, I don't know. Tell me random ability. I don't care. Random ability for a subjugator? Sure, yeah. yeah he yeah. has his two weapons his sword and lance and his heavy crossbow bolt. Or crossbolt. Lance. Lance, okay. Info. It can deal specifically. 1d12 plus 5 damage, and has a plus 10 to hit. So Dang. this is things hitting anyone. Except and, for maybe Del. And I finger gun him for 2 damage. Nice shot. Bang. And that's my turn. Right, cool. Sub to his turn. Hmm. <laughs> what the fuck are you here? Go wild, dude. Go wild, well, I want you to go off. <laughs> I, I know, but like... Kill Naveed. <laughs> Kill Emelyn. I, I I think out of his best option would probably use his uh his special thing on Otash because it's a big <laughs> fucking dragon running at him. You see what's called? He takes out a rod and fucking what's called shanks it on him as he uses this. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck! Oh, you've mm. seen Otash fucking what's called him and uh seizing. he's now paralyzed, seizing. And that's his action, I believe. I don't think you have a BA, right? I don't think so. No, Fuck it, we ball the, where's the, the taser is thing? The fucking... uh, <laughs> Using the taser is the BA. <laughs> and he'll, uh, seeing you guys, he'll fuck off over here. But also forgetting these things are here. <laughs> Tolko, your turn. Alright, uh, Tolko, uh, is, he's feeling, he's feeling really motivated. <laughs> And uh, he's going to hit the first, the guy who's running with Elders Blast. Elders Blast, uh, come on, come, come on, computer, Shh, come on. Elders, your blast. Elders, your blast. All it's... right, that's the first one, uh, and then second one. Come on, computer. Come on. All right, there's the second one. Misses. And then he's going to use uh, one sorcery point to target the next person. Which one's the next person? Uh, yeah, this person next to the panther. <laughs> nice, nice crit. Fuck! <laughs> so oh, shit. Damage. <laughs> he blasts a hole in his chest, and he dies. With Kakui's altering grace, Toko is feeling really motivated. <laughs> your rolls are back! Remember, like, you're really shit? That's really funny. <laughs> he needed his <laughs> wife. We needed Anything else? Um, I mean, I. Hmm. Can I do anything to help this dude who just got paralyzed? Uh, <laughs> not really. Point. You don't know what paralyzed him. Like, first of all, it's kind of foreign to you, aside from maybe electricity, but that's all I can glean from it. Uh, in that case, Toko's not really gonna do much. I don't think. I guess he's just gonna be like. 
Are you okay? <laughs> you like to attach uh, the, the figure? <laughs> are, you, are you choking? He doesn't choking? respond, which indicates are you something is probably bad. <laughs> are you choking? Are you choking? Okay, we should <laughs> probably get, get him something. I don't know what's wrong with him, but we need to get him some help. That's it, my turn. Del, your turn. Alright, charging into battle. Let's go. Uh, fuck, I don't want to hit Durk. <laughs> fuck, I guess you get a trample, buddy. I'm sorry. <laughs> you don't have to force a trample. I'm, I mean, I can just dodge out of the way. That's true. My dex is pretty good. Okay, big old, big old fucking buttercup. Uh, it's... Uh, moves Wait, it am I getting trampled? No. Alright, so... You see Del fucking riding on Buttercup coming in. Uh, Buttercup starts to put their, their head down and uh, has their, their antlers go out first, so... Oh, it's gonna ram into this guy real quick. And then I think this goes off. Same time. Yep. Yep. Make me that, make me that save. Uh, deck save. Uh, give me a bit. Okay. Oh. Deck save on the subjugator, I believe. Yeah. Shrink save. Right. That hits. So for five damage, gonna ram Ranch's ass and then two d six. Does it? Does he take the charge or is it if he feels? Yeah. It's he takes the damage. Okay. Takes the damage is, no matter what. Is it half? Or it it no? just it just no. says oh, like. Oh, it's it's yeah. the uh, what's it called? It's the go prone or something, right? Yeah, yeah go prone. Okay, so he takes the ten regardless. Alright, and then we do that fucking Mojo Tech you say Alright, let's have a little look see Lou. What the fuck are you? Look see Lou, what the fuck, fuck are you? you? You made them. Uh, what do I want to learn? <laughs> yeah, Taser 1, Safety Coat. Yeah, you know, the classic resistances, his vulnerabilities, immunities, and Spellbook. <laughs> Give me the Spellbook. <laughs> uh, what level? Yes, first, second, and third. Give me a third level. <laughs> Fireball. <laughs> <All right. laughs> <laughs> but he is... here's the fun here's the funny part he doesn't plan on using it because they're fighting yeah. Phoenicians. <laughs> <laughs> that's fair. Yeah, that makes sense. That's fair. Anyway, Gracie, come on out. Cut this bitch. <laughs> ah. Do it again. I'm hurt. Yeah, you... bye. <laughs> right, and then cool. uh, uh, we, no, the 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 elk oh, halts. Like those horses that run really fast. That's my turn. All right, we'll like do like mini pause combat here, and Otash will eventually get off. Uh, what's it called paralyzed. Okay. He comes up. Oh, oh, brother, sorry. Oh, you're from Spark, right? Yep. Enforcements. Oh uh, yes. Yeah. I'm gonna escort the rest of my men here, but uh, well, my allies are still up front, so. Come go help them. And you see a bunch of what's called rest of the other Phoenician soldiers. Eventually heads to like what's called Go directly downwards. Says so there what's called. Seem to be running away from something. Or escaping. Uh and... is this the only chokehold or oh, what's going on? This is the only chokehold. Uh fuck. You're not supposed to be here. Died. <clears throat> <laughs> did. We are being chased right now. <clears throat> By what? Uh, the gizmos. Uh, you, you, have you been told about that yet? Yeah. Yeah, we know. Is there anything else? A bit pesky. I think their leader is trying to get us as well. Alright, well then, I think let's just... glory kill for some fucking reason. I don't know, he's weird like that. Ugh. Anyways, let's, let's just try to get everyone out here. You do still see fighting, though. And there's, uh... I'm going to show them, but there's some injured what's called Phoenician soldiers as well in the area. But these are basically what's called so you have to really deal with. Oh, oh fuck. Okay. And uh, he'll go here and what's called... Otash will stay to what's called recover and help the, what's called his men recover, but if you want to call on him, you can do that. Got it. So, let me just move it up again. Uh, you can what's called reposition up on the second line. Let me delete this one. Can I believe this? Yeah. Reposition on the second line and combat will start again. Okay. Are we allowed like, right. one action or so, or do we only. Uh, you can one action, yeah. Move. I'll allow that. Okay. I'll allow well, that. Does it take an action to tell my Panther to move or no? Or bonus? Yeah, yeah. You, just, you can just say, follow me, Panther. That's it. Okay. 
Uh, Wait, so does that mean I... Okay, do I have to tell it to attack the guys that look like robots after I tell it to move up? And I, will, will uh, I use that bonus no, action? I think, it, I think it's smart enough. I won't... Yeah, I, I won't what's called. Make it too what's called. Fucking annoying. <laughs> uh, also, can... Uh, I breathe. Can uh, Toga climb up onto the top of this? Top of what? Uh, the this rock. This will take a while. Yeah. This will take a while, so... Your choice. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah. I'll do it. Oh, oh. Life? Okay. I did. Yeah, that was my right. one action. Alright, are we starting combat again? Uh, I'm putting bluff on people. Do we re-roll initiative? Do you guys want to? I'd like to keep my initiative. Mine was good. Like <laughs> yeah, you're keeping, you're keeping. Fuck you. <laughs> Tell Dirk to slow go. We'll add these I... initiative. Uh, remove Ooh. combatant. Remove combatant. Ugh. Remove combat. Yeah. Remove combat. <laughs> Remove combat. <laughs> you do see what's called Dirkus. You do some, so someone fucking noticeable. He looks exactly like the demons in your uh, flashbacks. More oh. so than the, uh, what's his name? Salad Knight. Funnily enough. Mm. <laughs> nice. Team kill. <laughs> Trying to get my no. KD up. <laughs> <laughs> Two, two per, two permission. You don't understand, Your Honor. I had to. It <laughs> looked like my sleep Your paralysis Honor. demon. Your Honor, my defendant has claimed oopsie poopsie. Have a good day. All right, Dirkus, your turn. Oh, uh, hmm. Uh, see, well, I, I could charge into the thick of it. Uh, no. At a kill. Counter. I guess. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I just don't want to have that discussion. Okay. Right. <laughs> anyway, uh I will I will ready in act I will stand here and ready in action to attack anything that comes next to me. Uh I want a marshal check. <laughs> yeah, I can do that as well. I want a marshal check macro. I don't. I'm sad. Straight intelligence. Oh, okay. Uh, two things. What do you want to learn? And I think they're more focused on surrounding this guy. So I don't think what's called reconsider the whole <laughs> rating your action. <laughs> oh, okay. In that case, let me back up to where I was. All right, so I can just so you're saying I can just walk in and start for me smacking them. Oh yes, you can. You might want to. Too. Uh, all right, well, uh, maybe you'd stand you next to me. You might want you to. I will. Uh, will swing away. Uh, nineteen. Seven. And seventeen. Yes. Okay. Six. Anything else? I forgot to light, forgot to light it. And then, whoops. We'll uh, we'll pretend everything's fine. Um, ch -ch 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 -ch. I'm gonna unwavering mark that guy. Wavering mark, got it. Just remind me. Yeah, I will. All right, Emily, fuck some bitches up. Oh shit. Uh, right, let's right, right. I should have <laughs> hit two of them. To, uh, to mark maximize you. mark spread. Attack the, uh, miss. You're trash. Actual garbage character. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you. But we love her. Renegades. They'll, uh, okay, half of these are gonna attack Nation Burn over here. Fucking arm blade. This is hit. I think that hits. No, it misses. Right. It's better. Third attack. Fuck <laughs> <It's two hits. laughs> Yep, That's there we go. Good, good, good. 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 Fuck you. Okay, you're trolling. Well, okay, you're wait, trolling. you said this guy looks like you, the thing that destroyed your home, and and you're and you're confused why Durgus thinks it's a good thing when he takes damage. Yeah. Does the 18 hit you? <laughs> uh, my AC is 18. I hit. I right. take the hit. You hit for nine damage. All right, Navid's turn. Kirby, I have a question because this you probably has come up before. Um, yeah. Do I have to attune to a spell to use the spells in it? Why wouldn't you? 
I like am spellbook as in like a... as just a spellbook. A spellbook. Are you trying to steal theirs? The reason the, I the, ask you, the, if, the if I run up to the uh, the subjugator and take up the spellbook off the corpse, can I cast two spells? They don't really have spellbooks. The subduer did. Well, also, uh, don't you have to like spend time to copy the spell? That's yeah. It's... I'd say you have to really attune to it, because okay. I think what's called Kai also requires that. Yeah. We had that That's, discussion. Um, yep. I'm, 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 okay. Um... It's the easy wave. Get ready for the next wave. <laughs> I fucking hate you, Kirby. <laughs> <laughs> what shall you be doing? What kind of mustard did you bring onto the table, Yellow? Gas. <laughs> <laughs> Gas them up, then! Uh, I would like to... Marshall check first. Um, I don't think I have. I do not have that, so I'll just roll an intelligence check. I will go yeah. ahead and make Marshall checks for everyone. One second. Okay. Um... 25... Um, seeing the flaming man, the most obvious position, um, blabberabba time, uh, burning hands. Blabberabber. Uh, roll a d20. Um, yep. Uh, also, I'd highly recommend you can stick next to me so I can defend you better. Yep. Um, so that is, I'm, <laughs> fourth level burning hands. Um, so Quite that painful. is... It's good thing he's immune. Three... Yeah, that's what I was planning on. Um, so I will just place the measured spell I slot. assume it's hitting these three because it won't reach Subjugator. Uh, my plan you're... was that. Oh, so it still misses Subjugator, <laughs> funnily enough. Um, okay, if it does. Um, if if I was able to miss the Subjugator, I'd probably move it so it's just like that. Yeah, there you go. That's still um, misses the Subjugator. <laughs> it's really hard that... to aim it. That's 3d6, and then it's three levels up, so it's another 3d6. So I roll another 3d6 then. So that's in total 23. damage. 23? Alright. Two fail, so... Funny items. What's half of 23? Like 11? 12? 11 or 12? Uh, 11 or 12, depending on how you round. 11, so nice. Or 12. <laughs> yeah, mine is long. <laughs> <laughs> Anything else, Nabeed? Um, He'll run up, you know, cast Burning Hand, and as he goes, like, directly through the Phoenician Infernal, he goes, Oh, thank God, I was just basing it off one assumption. And he, like, pats him on the back of it, and he's gonna end his turn. <laughs> I would have set you... I, I, I would have set you on fire, but I uh, guess right. I'll actually... If I may, I would like to actually move over here. Let me sure you can move. Thank you. <clears throat> this one will attack twice as well. Miss. Uh, Tash is busy. Renegade's turn. Or that's the other one. So let me remove this one. Giuseppe, your turn again. Okay. Uh, I have added martial checks to everyone. Thanks, and Daddy. I have Yay. fixed them. Now there's a little button for you to use it. They are found in the active abilities of features. Like I'm gonna cast Fairy Fire. Hold on, I have to figure out where I want to do this. <laughs> or Fire on High, not Fairy Fire. I like, suggest yeah, well, like here. You'll miss like one guy, but that's fine. It's a Subjugator. Yeah. You don't really what's going to have to worry about. Oh wait, actually. Oh wait, no, that's it. Okay, yeah, here. And Phoenicians are immune to fire, even though it's not fire. But I'm flavoring as fire. Ergo. He can avoid this easier. <laughs> no. I don't think that's how it works. <laughs> Here no, it goes. Yeah, it works. I'm ready. Thank Thankfully, he's that guy, though. Fire on high. Subjugator's turn. Alright, he passes, so only the fucking scrubs are advantaged now. I'll I'm give you the, uh, these top ones. Oops, not burning. Bleeding. Anything um, else? That's our spell uh, action. Your bonus action. I have my bonus action, so I'll just tell Panther to move up and attack. Sure thing, it'll attack and it'll pounce on you. You have 35 movement, yes you do. Fuck you. Uh, 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 uh. Kill! Uh, and I'll uh, try the attack thing. Just gang, what's, what's stronger, this or this? Fucking eat his ass. 
Ow. <laughs> oh shit, you're at 1 HP. Damn, never mind. I'm trash. Wait, no, uh, minus 5. There you go. And he's prone. <laughs> so, double advantage, which doesn't really do anything. But you have an okay. advantage. Let's see for a crit. If it's crit, it kills you. Uh, it was a bite. No crit. Oh well. Uh, anything else? Just that you can move. Um, oh, oh yeah. I'll move. Uh, uh wait, how far can I? Thirty feet. Oh, yep. I'll just move here. Okay. And the marshal check thing confuses me, but yeah, that's my turn. I think I failed that. It says six. Okay. Yeah, it fails. Up to okay. your ruling, that's but my turn. the panther might be able to make a bite attack against it because it says if the target is prone, the panther can make one bite attack against it as a bonus action. Oh, I used a claw one, so it, it wouldn't work. <laughs> I didn't know that. My bad. Yeah, it's, it's part of it's he's, part of pounce. He's nearly dead though, so it's fine. But yeah, yeah. Subjugator. Uh, fuck the panther. That's an easy kill. <laughs> easy kill. Fifteen. Bye. <laughs> Second attack on the guy in front of him. Does this hit? That is a seventeen. That does hit. Um. Fifteen. Uh, this one will do it twice as well. Shit. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Minus nineteen. Owie, zowie. Holy this shit. This one will attack. There's a lot, but I think the closest target is Navid, so let's attack Navid. <laughs> unfortunately. I will give a disadvantage to that. Good choice. Other than use with when a creature that you can see, that works, I think, right? When a creature you can see attacks a target, so the target of the attack has to be within five feet. Okay, let's get the disadvantage sixteen, disadvantage fourteen. This is both miss. Uh, the sixteen and the fourteen. Uh, oh no, the first one would be a disadvantage. Okay. The oh, second one would be normal. Four, so it'll be a ten. Plus 10, so that'd be a 20 to hit. Ow. Jesus. You can shield. I love these guys. It was 20? Okay, then I will I will shield it. Yeah. So you can shield both attacks, and yeah, you're fine. Cool, cool. Toko, your turn. Okay, uh, Toko will get a little bit closer to the edge first. And then afterwards, he will start raining down edge blasts on these guys. Let's see. Fuck them up. Uh, so for the first edge blast, it's gonna be on this guy. Uh, the this one. Which one? Them. Got it. Yeah. Uh, do, do, do. Yes. Uh, before you yes. kill this one, I'm gonna duplicate him just in case, so he's not okay. taking off the, the fucking tracker. <laughs> Both miss. Both miss. Holy crap, this dude has high AC. <laughs> what does bro mean? What happens? Anything uh, else? Uh, and then he will twin spell <laughs> once more. Da da da, he's a sorcery point. And then he will do his second. I was blast at. The other subjugator over here <laughs> in the fairy fire. Oh, they're aiming at the subjugator. I thought they were aiming at the renegades. I'm like, what the fuck's going on? Uh, so someone rules at that one at advantage because it's fairy fire. It's not advantage since he saved the saving throw. Oh, okay. Oh, oh okay. Just such boss. You'll hit this shit. Miss both misses. And then I will use one bonus action to convert a second level spell slot into two sorcery points. Got it. You marked that down for me. Yeah, I I'm, got it. Anything else? Uh, March check. Yes. Yay. <laughs> Alright, I'll give you two things. What do you, wait, no, that's not, it's not just not 18. What do you want to learn? Uh, hmm. I guess for the subjugators, uh, resistances and I guess abilities. Abilities is not a lot. It's honestly what's called. 
Uh, it's though his weapons and let's go a shield. That's really it for his abilities, quote unquote abilities, and resistances are cold and fire. Okay. And that will be then my turn. Infernal time. All right. Uh, let's kill the renegades. I'm actually sick of them. All right. Bye. It's gonna attack. Bye. <laughs> And we'll pivot over here. Turn. Oh shit, okay, we, we on this beach. Oh. <laughs> 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 <He's pretty red laughs> that. You did, holy fuck. Okay, uh, not doing that. I'm gonna go attack the fucking... Uh, you guys got that handle. Okay, uh, the subjugator, uh, it's gonna get hooves. It's gonna get hooves. Uh... Uh, oh, that misses. I know. Fuck. Okay. Uh, Let's see. Your okay. weapon is fucking insane. My I know. That? I know. Fucking idolizes. <laughs> oh, Yay! that hits with bless on top. All right, that's good. Smiting uh, or nar? Uh, no. I mean, no. We might have to fight other shit. Yes, you do. Anything else? Uh, oh yeah, use a PA. So funny. Oh wait, plus? Hang on. Plus, plus. Ah. Uh, you know, what? let's do my little funny. Little, little funny. Oh, you want to learn? Oh, give me oh, the plus and give me the resistances. Resistances, I'll fish one. Uh, Finish the infernal subjugator. Oh, we can we can get our allies. Let's go. Nah, let's see your allies. It's funny. For when okay. we betray them. True. Angel. Resistances for subjugator already learned, which is cold and fire. Oh, immunities? Or vulnerabilities? Vulnerability, psychic. Yo! That's Ray Shine, okay. Giuseppe. Oh my gosh. Anything else? Alright, Dergus, your turn. Speed on that bitch. Uh, hit, with a uh, a hit to the renegade above me, and a hit to the renegade to my right. Got it. One hit, and one are, hit. Are they fairy fired or not? They're not. Fairy Fire is uh, gone now because Fairy Fire people are dead. Okay. We do have. Uh, for blessing the first one. Oh. And. No, no, sorry. Blessing the second one. Because the, the first one's one. a. Yeah. The second one. Okay. Four, oh. 13. That misses. Dang. Anything else? Hmm. We're not afraid of thinking we're gonna fight more. I could, uh... I'm gonna hang on to my second wind. Got it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Emlyn! Fucking carry! Uh, uh, clear the ads. One hit, two hit, please hit. Uh, nine. Hit. Ah, ah, ah! You're down. <laughs> Moves to Hunter's Mark here, 1d6. Yeah. Uh, that's 5 plus 6, 11. Right. That's it. And then, uh, who's next up in turn? Renegade. Fucking Naveed. <laughs> Sorry. <Yep. laughs> fucking is... Naveed, no! Yep. Naveed, your hey, turn. Please don't do that. Um, okay. Um... I saw my song name. <laughs> Listen, I'm looking for I'm looking for the actual path. Turn to the guy at the bottom. I'm gonna green flame and blade him, and I'm gonna obliterate him. Rock him. Let me uh, just roll for music. Roll for bless. Roll for bless. Uh, Thirteen. And uh, the other one. I assume that would hit. Let me just get uh, the music. I want to that. My bad. Greens your flame. Uh, search engage. And you hit it. There we go. Select file. Big track. Engage. Oops, that's loud. Let's go back. Uh, does that hit? No. Are you hitting which one? Renegade the or? Bottom one. The bottom one. So I hit the bottom one for 12, three of it being fire damage. And then. Uh, 12 misses, and then. No, the, the 20. The 20, okay. So, I, I was saying it's 12 damage. 
12 damage. Going for the 10, the 20, the thankfully 30, don't have strong. resistance to anything, so I think that's... 9 plus 12 is 21. That's what you're doing? Yep. 21 damage. Got it. Um, that's my attack and protection, and I end my turn. Got it. Uh, Captain's. We're helping Captain, or finishing Captain's gonna... He's gonna see you, and see like what's happening. He's gonna fucking just shove him. <laughs> shove him prone. Fuck off. <laughs> Fuck your bitch ass. Never mind. <laughs> he's yeah, strong. He's garbage. He's gonna shoot him. He's gonna like, attack again. Miss, miss. Alright. Atash. He's busy. Just step your turn. Heck, if you, okay. you uh, march check this, you can clear it. This guy? The trick, yeah. The trick with this fight is you have to focus on saves for the subjugators. Because their AC is incredibly high for a normal thing. <laughs> That doesn't hit. Damn. Okay. Uh. Mm -hmm. I guess I'll just Eldritch Blast. Uh. Does that kill? No. Okay. Well, I shoot him again. Oh, you blast! You blast! Roll D four. Roll D four. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Uh. Wait, wait. Get it to her higher. <laughs> Get that look, baby. Come on. Why You're game for the man. Yeah! Oh! <laughs> yeah. Glasses, yeah. On. Bang, bang. Yeah! Just for context, then. Subjugator's AC is 24. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> Have fun. Anything else you said, dude? Uh. That was action. I think that's it. Yeah, that's my turn. Got it. Subjugator. Uh oh. Fuck your horse. No! No! <laughs> oh, one shit. Will... Yeah, gone. He's dead. This one will attack. It's smart, unfortunately, it's a human. Naveed! Oh, for fucking. <laughs> um. <laughs> Ow! So I'll. Oh, Unless I'll Dirkus take... wants to do a funny. Yeah. You do uh, have a reaction. Again. I mean, I, I will crit cancel that. Alright, yeah. got it. It's a, it's a team bonding, holy shit. I'll say you take seven then. This one will take. That misses. <laughs> okay, cool. Okay, we'll keep it that way. You take uh, seven damage. Got it. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Dirk is just saving the bee. Mm. I like that. Tolko, your turn. Crits. Okay. Uh, let's see. This amount of crit canceling, it should have been a grave cleric. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so let's see. We still have those two. I'll clean those up since I don't think I can hit the AC. Do you have any saving throw spells? Uh, only have a, have a one time use spell. Yeah, well, long rest spell, but I don't want to use it for oh. now. Damn, that's annoying. Uh, so I'm gonna hit the uh that's the long. <laughs> I'm gonna hit the first close one with Eldest Blast. Uh, the Renegade, I assume. Yeah. Bye. Miss. Yes, I missed the corpse. Uh, and then we're going to use another twin spell. <laughs> I love hey, that uh, Glass, you, you do know there are other uh, meta magic things than hmm. twin spell. Yeah, right? the other one's transmute, <laughs> let, but let but I can just hit pe I can hit two people at once. Mm -hmm. Or you can really? kill these guys with psychic in one blow. Does he have psychic off. spells though? That's a thing. Uh, no, I do not. You yeah, transmute trans does a little funny. I don't think you can transmute this. Uh, let me check. Transmute spell. Right. Uh, true. nope. Acid, cold, fire, lightning, poison, and thunder. Fuck! Got it. That's stupid. So, twinning spell to run, uh, roll attacks. Yep, and then for the next renegade, here we go. Miss. Hit. Uh, bye. Now it's just these fuckers. And I'm the martial check again. Uh, what did you roll? Uh, four. Shit. <laughs> yeah, nothing. Why is it green? Don't it's, ask. So uh, I don't know why Nick has that, so I'm gonna ignore it. It's Infernal. because it's, a, it's an ability check that I wasn't able to like properly do it. <laughs> Trash. <laughs> Wait, is that a Terraria blade? Yeah. It took you long enough. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, the volcano. Delp. <laughs> oh fuck! Oh, oh, Put a good fury. No, no molten fury is the pick. Okay, uh, 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 who do I help? Oh, 
Fuck, who do I help? Who do I help? Oh, fuck, uh, oh, fuck, oh, fuck, oh, fuck, oh, fuck, oh, fuck. Not, help, not help, the infernal. The red hot wing. The red hot wing. The red hot wing. Yeah, beat Which up the subjugator next to you. Which one? They're all. They're both hot wings. <laughs> okay, the one closer right. to you. I Welcome said. Right. Right, closer. You're good. You're okay. good. We're good. Let us cook. Okay. okay. Look, look. Unless until you get a sword that gains more power, the more you run. Uh, just, just hit the thing closest. Okay. Don't tell me what to do. <laughs> so come here. <laughs> Kidding. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fine. I'll fucking hit him with Gracie at least. Come here, Gracie. I can hit him. Oh, Please hit. That's not gonna hit. Jesus uh, Christ. Hit him again. Damn it. Oh my God. <laughs> do it again. Yay. Okay, that hit. Oh, dang. <laughs> Wanna smite? <laughs> <laughs> no, I gotta save, bro. I gotta Wanna save? Shit. You know how long it's gonna take? <laughs> yeah, I know. It's coming soon. <laughs> End of my turn. Yeah, speed run. DC's 13 for these. Uh, Dirk, it's your turn. Alright, let's see if I can hit the subjugator. You got this. Uh, I believe in you. you no, yeah, no. Dirkus is not going to step in with the Infernal. Bless uh, Alright. Two swings. We do have Bless. Swing one. Easy, Doesn't easy, matter. Easy, easy. What a rune dash. <laughs> Bro is yeah, uh, yeah, I shortened my rune dash. Uh, uh, Alright. How many charges are they expending? What? What? No, I'm not. Oh, you're not? Damn. <laughs> this is just a base. He's right next to me. It is a do basic take, swing. Do take note that if you're in, if you're in dash, that gets doubled as well. That's like anyway. Uh, swing one. Uh, he has my um, um, what's it called? Unwavering mark. Got it. Swing two. All right. Swing two. All these crits today. It's kind of surprising. Bro hits. hits. Oh, okay. We make it uh, a comeback, boys. Alright, 16 damage. And he has disadvantage to hit everyone except me. Got it. At least I won't hit Naveed now. You guys are working really well together. Like, unintentionally, too. <laughs> That's the point. At the start we're, of this round, looking. you guys hear reinforcements, and thankfully, it's not fucking uh, Ember Spawns, because I'm not that mean. But, <laughs> you see, basically what's called some like, sort of a squadron up here in this corner. Oh, fuck. They'll roll initiative at the start of next turn. Yo, maybe those are robots. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta go uh, dismantle them! Who knew? Oh, you also hear buzzing in the air. Oh, fuck. They have drones, run. Oh, they're gonna drone st Oh, no! Fuck, you can't be- <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit, there's actual drones. Fuck! They have allies. Uh, I'm win. Evelyn, shoot. Evelyn, uh, uh, uh. <laughs> Evelyn, Evelyn, yes. Evelyn, aim for the goddamn drones. Aim Evelyn, for the aim for the drones. <laughs> okay, Evelyn, if you're actually telling you that? I don't, no, I don't, I, I don't have the concept mind of understanding that those are fucking drones. <laughs> <laughs> Might want to marshal them then soon. Attacking, uh, subjugator. Okay, useless. Navi, your turn. <laughs> okay, I see the... The, the, the things of so fucking. These will be uh, 50, 50 foot in the air. Okay. Yeah, I'll marshal check them. What the fuck? What the uh, fuck? Yeah, they're uh, drones. They're really weak, but. You're familiar with a pipe bomb, right? <laughs> Yeah, I'm familiar uh, with the Oh, they're suicide bombers. Uh, to, be, to make it perfectly honest, Naveed has probably made one by this time. <laughs> yeah, he has one too. <laughs> Why is it called Abomination? <laughs> okay. 50 feet in the uh, air. That. 50, 50 feet well, well, in the air. Well, hey, can you marshal check their movement speed? Oh, no, no, no. I, I, let me check something. I love um, this. 50 feet in the air. Abomination. Um. I can't hit them now. That fucking sucks. Can I ask for their movement speed, or...? Yeah, I'd say you can, because you roll pretty high, and they're also not really too strong. They're fast as fuck. 60 feet okay. of flying. So if I had... Yeah. Um, let's... It's... i suggest one of your guys, uh... Yeah. Someone take, like, clear most of them out. When you can, yep. when possible. That's what I suggest as a DM. I, uh, I do have something that can clear them all out, real quick. What? <laughs> Disintegration. No, I'm kidding, the fire beads. 
I don't know. I have, I have two necklaces. I have two fireballs. Yeah, that's what I said. Yeah, yeah, no, I'm telling Kirby. She got me balling. Uh, I was gonna take care of the uh, subject areas, which are very hard to hit. <laughs> as you've been able to tell. I hit them twice last turn. Checkmate, DM. Yeah. Which one are you? Okay. <laughs> uh, I will. <laughs> I'm, I should just deal with the subjugator. Someone else wants There's to. There's a way of fighting these drones. guys, but. Um, okay. I'm gonna boom and blade the subjugator. Let's see how this goes. You, you could uh, you could attack the other subjugator. This. Yep. Why is that Rock'em? Sock'em. D4. D4, do it, buddy. Miss. Me too. Why is your inspiration? Actually, no. That, yeah. That's a. No. It, it, Actually, it's against if you want. It is against me if I do that, but I can. Your choice. Yeah, I believe. Oh, hey! Fuck. You believed. Part God. of the cards. You fucking knock him out. I fucking... As that happens, and I go... I go, thanks for the setup! And I fucking steamroll the guy by clotheslining him. <laughs> Holy fuck. I'll say... I'll, are you doing it lately or no? Uh... Yeah. Bye. <laughs> um... Alright. Uh, and then I'm gonna point out the fucking drones. Um, it looks like they can fucking explode, and that's the end of the thing. <laughs> <laughs> if you play the dub, you understand. <laughs> uh... <laughs> we gotta trip him. We gotta trip him. <laughs> so I was just waiting, Giuseppe. <laughs> Anything Giuseppe would like to do? I. I... Okay, hold on. Uh, hmm. Do you guys think it'd be worth fairy firing these drones or no? Uh, probably not. I imagine they'll go down in like one or two hits, and they shouldn't uh, have that high hit of AC. Them, right? You know, being able to hit also. I good. don't. Marshall, check their AC. My my True. my hope is that if I if they can believe, maybe we could hit it so it explodes and then it just does a chain reaction. Um, Ooh. I'll like move here and. Yeah, just Oh, Marshall, check their AC. Marshall, check their movement and AC. What do you want to learn? AC? You AC, uh, AC's facts. 14. Yeah, no. I already gave uh, you a move, but... Okay, so it's not worth fairy firing then? Yeah, 14's fairly easy for most of us to hit. Okay, and I shoot this enemy next to me. For nice choice! Damage. He'll take four. Okay. And I... Yes, I'll. Uh. I'll use the bag of tricks. The jungle. Heck, jungle like juice. Welcome jungle to juice. the jungle! I don't know what that one is. One, that's the weasel. Weasel? Alright, plutonium import weasel. What do you want him to I'm do? Not, okay, I'm I not... tell the weasel to. I don't know, uh, go over to these giant robots and unscrew any bolts. <laughs> Start fucking shit up. <laughs> Start fucking shit up, okay. <laughs> Be a weaselly little we, rascal. We are sending our kamikaze familiar, motherfucker. <laughs> motherfucker. I'll play smart with the weasel. It will go here and <laughs> dance around. Take the dodge action. So it, what's it called? Yeah, ultra Just instinct weasel. <laughs> oh, for them, and it's gonna do shit. Yeah. Uh, anything else? Nah, that was my action bonus action and martial check. So I'm All good. Right. Soldier Gator. Uh. One, two, one, two, three, four. Okay. Roll D4. Man, I hate killing the ads. It's not my favorite. Horse! Crit again, stop critting. <laughs> For 28. <laughs> Jesus. That's Christ. what? Uh, that's Jeez. what the fourth crit? Yeah. I've, I've canceled yeah. two. I've canceled two. Let one through, and I'm letting this one through as well. Yeah, specifically from only the shortened lance have been like the critics on the enemy team. That's yeah. how I feel. So we'll go, your turn. Uh, <laughs> That's question. how you feel on Battlefield. <laughs> uh, so question, should I try taking care of the drones first, or should I hit these guys with a Sleet Storm? I I think you should hit the drone with maybe an Eldritch Blast or something, or maybe maybe I, maybe a Sleet Storm. I don't know. I don't know, It because hindering are them the is coming it's, in. You Oof. have two turns to, I guess, take them out, theoretically. They can also Whoa. dash, though, so be careful. Toloko is also 60 feet up in the air, so he's on even ground. Yeah. Mm -hmm. 
Your so, yeah, I guess I'll take out some of these drones. Uh, let's see, this one right here. Mm -hmm. First attack. Yeah, this one, uh, they're gonna get Elgis Blast. And, hmm. <laughs> you know what? Uh, I will also use <laughs> uh, the Ice Rose that I have gotten. Click on Shit. it. Come on, let me. I don't know what that is. I, can I still don't know what that does. You want mm. me to show or you want to keep it? Uh, you... It'll be kind of obvious once they, you know, see it. Once yeah, see it. they can see the effects of it. Okay, info. Click info. Damn, 1d4 cold Damn. damage. Good against Phoenicians. In this turn, wow. Yeah. Right, uh, one. yeah. One. Beat a 14. <laughs> What is inspiration? You have, you have inspiration. <laughs> sure thing, let's use it. <laughs> Let him cook. Watch, Watch, Watch the drive. Nice. Ah, there we go. Alright, and then here's the second attack. <laughs> oh, oh my God. goodness. Well, what? Can, we, can we reset Kirby. the timeline real quick? <laughs> Kirby, do the, do the drones blow up in a chain reaction? No. Sad. Oh. Okay. <laughs> The name of these are Mark 2, so maybe the first one was. <laughs> oh, Mark, Mark 1 definitely sells hey. the most, dude. Uh, uh, after the first one, uh, he kind of seals it, he does a martial check on them. Nice. Uh, what do I want to learn? Uh, weaknesses. Weaknesses? None. Okay. Uh, and then he, uh, will use one of his sushi plates. Squid. <laughs> Yep. Wicked. Did twist spell. He's <laughs> literally the Toho thing. Just fucking shoot bullets every time. Yep. And uh, let's see. We're I thought going you hated be... Toho. I we're, hate Toho. We're going for uh, that... this one. Which one? Got it. I'll go until thirty. Oh! That's a third this turn. Oh no! It's surviving by one HP. <laughs> you know, yeah, by one HP. <laughs> Damn. Jeez. And, uh, yeah, that's in my turn. Got it. Finish Infernal, uh... Wait, actually, wait, no, the second one will have added... No, it should be dead, because I added a... The ice oh, damage. Oh, yeah, 1d4. That should be, yeah, regardless. Bye. Yeah. Nice shot. Surprised you missed, like, two, though. <laughs> Out of your four. Very, uh, very sad <laughs> indeed. Bro is ready. Bro is ready. Uh, Why you swear you? This twice to say, yeah. I just realized yeah. there's a line of text here. I gotta delete. Uh oh, line of text. Uh, just gonna aim at these. That's so fucking good. I, I love that he just has that. <laughs> Takes out a hand crossbow from his waist. It has, one, like, it has one charge, the fucking bomb right there just shoots at this thing. Oh! Wait, does it splash? Yes, it does. Oh, That's sick. how explosion Oh, moves. it passes, but thankfully, uh, I think you- yeah, I think- what's it called? Steel deals. <laughs> I think the damage roll is high enough that it doesn't it's, pass. Next half is, uh, yeah. 18. 18. You see what's called, all these drones immediately, like, combust as the Phoenician Infernal fucking shoots them. I- I- I love Bombardier. He should shoot himself. So Holy shit. Although that has one ammo. Okay, so I don't. I okay. I s explained this before, Nick. I understand. <laughs> All right, but the context is funny. These fuckers now. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. Kill the subjugator this time. You got this. Believe. Mm. <laughs> mm. In your heart well, of hearts. Look, you're even blessed. I'm. Yeah. I, I'll have Spark help from uh, 30 feet away. Mm. Too blessed, too blessed. Think actually, this is probably a better if I can actually pull this off. Oh, fuck. Okay. Uh, I'm going to fucking tackle this bitch. <laughs> tackle him oh. to the ground quickly. Tripping oh. his ass. Do it. Trip his ass. Trip his bitch ass. Roll me that athletics. Uh. Uh. Subjugator. Yeah. 
was a 19. Fuck! <laughs> 18 and 19. No, it didn't work. Oh, I don't know if I should do that, or maybe I just go for another attack so I can get my, my second attack off. Fuck it. Attack so I can get full arm. Yeah. Oh, D4. D4, D4, D4. Fish for Fuck! <laughs> This cog's a fate. <laughs> no. Okay, let's, let's get my fucking martial check out of the way. No. <laughs> okay. End of hey, look, it's green. That's a natural twenty. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, these things will now activate and will be part of the combat. <clears throat> Thankfully, leaving Iron Statue is lower. Emlyn, Emlyn, oh, uh, Emlyn. What do I want to do? <laughs> I'm gonna remove the renegade from the combat because there's not any. Yep, no more renegade. Emlyn will shoot a uh, thingy. Emlyn shoots uh Oh, if she had blessed, that misses. Emlyn, hmm. don't forget to look for their weaknesses. See the chink in the armor. She's trying. <laughs> Did she give her magic eye? Give her a gun. Okay, the Mecha Chimera. No. It's your turn. These will start charging. Do they go after the weasel? Yes. Can they can they see the weasel? They'll go for the weasel. I, <laughs> I guess they can. These are robots. It's pretty fucking uh, pretty fucking wild. Oh yeah, you have ex this has expertise on perception. Oh, oh so yeah, no, you can definitely. Can, maybe it smells that it's like a f thing because it's from Megatrix. That hits. Uh... You did good, Weasel. <laughs> you did good, Pig. You, you did. You wasted that one turn. So this one will sprint to here. They'll be dashing. Navi, your turn. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna cast haste. Got it. Do that. Um, that's basically. I assume do I, yourself. Do I get the haste? Action? Yeah, on myself. Yeah, you get the haste action. Okay. Because so, I could use a little extra movement speed. <laughs> Wait, no, I don't need to. I have rune dash. Yeah, you can rune dash. Um, take the. Remember to marshal. These are pretty scary. I will. I will do that because just. What do I want to learn? Uh, what you have. Uh, you have the attacks, bite horn claws. It's you know vulnerabilities, which is really much. Uh, immunities actions. It's just multi attack, which is funny, and fire breath. Okay. Uh, what are its immunities? Immunities, poison, psychic. Okay. Um, I will make the attack action. I don't think I can booming blade this right because it's only just a weapon attack. Yep. No booming. Okay. <laughs> it does proc your what's called a uh, bonus action though. Just in case, that's the first one. And this is that one. It's... Which is okay. So that's just the eight, and then I think it's just eight damage. Yep. <laughs> End of a turn. The captain's turn. They'll go here, go there, yep. and they'll obliterate it. One, two, three, four. Just kill. Okay. Anything above a fourteen? Okay. Twelve, thirteen. All uh... of them. 20, yes. 25, 36. Oops, wrong one. <laughs> Wait, no. 25, oh, no, it's just, 30, it's just, one, it's just one, it's just one, it's just one. I just remember one of them is dead, I think. <laughs> so yeah, I think okay. the attacks were 17, yeah, 12, 13. That still kills us. <laughs> really funny. <laughs> yeah, you see what's called this. Uh, Captain, make work, work of the uh, camera. One of them, rather. Okay. I'm gonna show it back. Giuseppe? Yes, uh... Just one subjugators and these fuckers. Okay, I'll marshal check the big thing. Got it. DC 13. Actual crit, what do you want to learn? You get two things. You already learned uh, immunities, you have its attacks, and uh... You have its attacks, bite, horn, claws, and fire breath. What? I, I don't two. know. You choose for me, I don't know. I'll choose for you. You get this, and you'll get a. <laughs> you'll get this. Hmm. And I'm gonna sh wait. Do I, can I shoot twice or just once? 
just once. Okay, I shoot the subjugator. Nice choice. And... Hmm... You know what, my, I'm bag of tricksing again, I guess. My, <laughs> this is my final use for the last that. one. Yeah. Will it be? Four is... That's the uh, boar. Which one's that boar? Like yeah, pig? Boar. Yeah, pig. Got it. Jungle. Oh, man. Sorry, what? What oh, commander are you getting? Uh... Uh... Attack the giant robot. <laughs> you got it. It will charge. Hog Rider looking head ass and sack. Miss. So yeah, it doesn't do anything. And that's my turn. Last subjugator. You're not here, but I'm gonna attack you regardless. Huh? <laughs> so, any of those hit? <laughs> <laughs> both do. Ow! <laughs> Alright, fucking <laughs> uh, God! Okay, I'm minus fucking 16. Let me from my con saves. Oh. Uh, Yay! Oh. Uh, oh. You're good. It's all cool, your turn. <laughs> okay. Uh, first. A martial check. Actual crit. <gasps> what you want to learn? Uh, for what to? Uh, uh let's so see. Can I learn? And well, is this thing a creature? It's a construct. Okay, but okay, so it's a construct, but it's not listed as a creature. Got it. Got. It. Uh, and then I guess the second thing, um. What can I learn about it? Uh, you're ready to learn everything, honestly. Okay. I learned the damage of its shit, but I wouldn't really recommend it. Uh, Just know that it has three attacks. Okay, then can I learn one thing about these other guys? Good thing. Alright, um... You have, what's it called? Immunities, vulnerabilities, it's what's called condition immunities, and it's attacks. It's attacks are called Blade and Hammer. Uh... It has multi-attack and Whirl. Like real play. Well, blade and hammer. <laughs> so exactly what's on their uh, icon? I, That's crazy. Uh, I will learn their attacks. Sure. Which one? Uh, let's say whirl. Whirl. There you go. Uh, there's named Whirlpool zero zero five. He is summoned <laughs> when this ability is used. The statue can use its action to spin its waist and make it basically what's called a uh, spinning cleave. Oh, that's that's funny. Do they have like a, <laughs> a a thing in their body that makes them spin 360 like an owl? They're uh they're ballerinas, because <laughs> that doesn't look like it. I see. Oh, well, uh, only thing Toku can do is keep Eldritch blasting. Go for it. I think missed, we get the sauce of your boys. Hit. Eight. Uh, do I want to use this or she's playing for this? Mm -hmm. Nah, I'll save it. Uh, that would be the end of our turn. Got it. Infernal! Do uh, you want to find a subjugator or go for the kill? <laughs> hit the subjugator, please. Save us. No That's our big way. threat right now. <laughs> Let's get another stack. Oh, 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 and oh, oh. <laughs> wow, the subject, the, the infernal is kind of trash. Who knew? You could have cleared this if you wanted to. Well, he likes you guys. Your turns out. <laughs> yeah, three attacks. Wait, <laughs> wait, make one of them count and you can smite them. <laughs> did, 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 did we skip my turn? Your turn's before Dell, or yeah, after Dell. Yeah, I, I swear Dell had a round and then I didn't go around. Oh! <laughs> he, on. he is gone. He's gone. He's gone. He has to be gone. gone. Kill him. Yeah! Kill! Kill! Alright. Wait, well, yeah, we uh, did! We did. I'll give it two turns. Alright, uh, first turn, what do you want to do? Damn! Uh, probably just like run up. Okay. You can I was dash, gonna run up and hit. Well, I, I'll just dash for turn one. 
All right, turn one. Turn yeah, two. no, yeah. After after Dell took her turn, then you rolled initiative for those guys, and then we went back to Emily. Oh, I forgot. My bad. Uh, I guess I'll just move up to here and oh, no, wait. start beating down this Chimera. Go for it. Wait, wait hold on, days. hold on, hold on. I was Redash? here. Redash. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? 30 Redash? feet per charge. How far do we gotta go? Perfect. Alright, two charges of Rune Blade. Could, could you angle it so it's just a straight line? You can uh, do a straight like... line. It has to be a straight line. You can't do like one Rune Dash, then in the go. Unless how you have you... X. How far do you dash? 30 feet per charge. I've used two. So I can go 60 feet. I'm gonna go like right here. I'm gonna attack this guy with your dash? Yeah. Go for it. Careful. <laughs> Don't worry. Holy this fuck. is definitely being careful. Oh no. Alright, uh, make an attack roll. Oh no, it's like history repeating itself. Oh, oh no! Inici uh, inspiration. Just inspiration? Yeah, oh, oh, okay, I'm burning my inspiration. Court reset. None of that one. <laughs> Alright, there we go. What's uh, your, uh, plus. Damage, so that's uh, one damage. 1d8 so. force damage per. So you use two, right? So 2d8. So that'll 13. be. 4 plus 9 is 13. I think we should give Arcane inspiration for the cojones on this man. <laughs> Good luck. Everybody chopped in a second! <laughs> Alright, as part of an attack action, so I get one more swing. Mm -hmm. Alright, uh, another swing at that guy in front of me. Nice hit for zero damage because he missed. <laughs> Roll for plus. Roll for plus, plus, plus. Alright, you hit. Yay! Yeah! Yeah! Huh. <laughs> That's 24 damage. I don't see its health bar. It's halfway. Halfway. Oh no. <laughs> Anything else? Uh. Um. Hmm. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna action surge. Yeah. yeah. Good choice. <laughs> you might want to keep there too. Uh, I'm down nine HP. I'm fine. Uh, and I'm going to swing two more times at uh this guy. All right. Yeah. Balls. All right. Let's see if he's hit. Hit one. Hit two. You got this. Very close. 28, no, 18. Yep. I really should have enchanted yeah, it with light. <laughs> that extra D4 might have come in handy. Uh, no, I think that's it. Uh, hey, Emelyn, can you pick off the one I beat to a pulp? It's an unfortunate part because I'm it's sorry. their turn next. <laughs> it's their turn now. Mm. That's why I was worried. Alright. Uh... Turn order. Is two, two turns got to my head. I'm sorry, guys. Yeah, that's first why attack. I was that's why I was attack. Miss. Uh, crit cancel. Good choice. Uh, this thing's turn. It's gonna do what you call a zaza. What? What do I? Uh, how much damage do I take from the crit? Uh, it's how much damage is it? Two d six plus three. So two six plus three, eight damage. Hmm. So, this thing will hit you with the Zaza again. Miss. Hit. 13. I don't two know what 16s? that is. Two 16s, both misses. Wait, that's your battle axe. That's your battle axe. Oh, wait. What? Yeah. I was... You just... You at skull, you have one of your binds in, so that always happens. Oh, Regardless... oh, I, oh, I know what happened. I tried to type minus 13. Miss. Miss. Yep. Miss, miss. The Zaza! Hit. Oh, uh, ow. I'm alive. I am standing upright. <laughs> I do require assistance, though. Yay, yeah, fucking Zaza. Look at that. <laughs> <laughs> the last reinforcements will show up. Give me a bit. There's oh, more. God. It's the last ones. Don't worry, guys. These it's the last ones. Out. 
yeah. All right. He's so, naked and afraid. All right. Yeah. So I'm going to chuck a uh, fireball at my feet. <laughs> you already did your turn, unless it's also the action. It's like, what kind of action is it? Yu Gi Oh! It's called a, uh, it's called a go out like a hero action. It's your bonus action. <laughs> actually, these sound like immediate fire, thankfully, no. What oh, it's the... a BA. So are you second winning, or are you actually just blowing yourself up? Oh, uh, no, 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 that was a joke. I'm not. Okay, go <laughs> tell. Because I feel, I feel like no dashing in, kind of. I, yeah, I thought, didn't I, really could, have I, thought I could. Plan. I thought I could slam into one and just nuke it down. So they they, <laughs> three. they they proved to be slightly tougher than I expected. All right, anything else? No, I think not. Right, one second win. It my t my turn's been over, Kirby. Oh, what are you, okay. Emlyn? Uh, oh no! <laughs> Why is he he's there? Giving, he's giving you a benefit. But, also, you know. who who's this? Uh, who's this? Weird who's this fuck boy? We'll get to that when he starts initiative. That misses. Hit the other one. <laughs> <laughs> no, you, you, what is he doing? What is he doing? <laughs> He's uh, being a hero. This thing's gonna feast on the boar. He did a good job making this fucking sculpt. Hey, an action to nuke to negate that action is good. Yep. And it's minus 12. You're dead. Ugh, it will charge towards. Oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> the V, your turn. Alright. Fucking. Fucking idiot. <laughs> Navi, go, 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 go. We'll take care of it over here. Go, go, go. Yeah, um, up. Because, wait. Actually, no, you don't have to do that. Because you can just uh, easily go through it. Um, uh, I'm gonna. Can I uh, grab Durgus and throw him out? Does he want you to? If he, uh, does he resist, then no. Durgus will not resist. Then, Alright, throw right. him out. Uh, throw him behind me, exact same time as that. Uh, fucking explode now. Shatter. Shatter? There you go. These are actual constructs, too. Um. Aim up. I use my inspiration. I don't think I want to blob her off of this. <laughs> Sadly. Choice. But it will Wait. hit me. I think. Oh, it will hit you? Unless, Sorry, not... unless you. I don't know. What do, you, do you want to count that? Oh, shit. Well, no. <laughs> Is I because okay because if Good that fucking looks, placement, I'll get hey this. hey the strategic dash in see they're all like neatly lined up. Is shatter extra damage or just uh, uh they have all they all disadvantage. Okay, one fail, two fail, three let's roll again fail, four. Yeah, one passes. All right, that's not too bad. How much damage? Thirteen. Thirteen. 13. Um, 7. I would like to request your flavor as, um, tasted action. I would like to whip around, turn to Durgus, uh, rip off the necklace of fireballs on his neck, and throw it at, uh, this person. Ah, uh, yeah, no, go ahead. It's one fireball down. We have one left. Does that count as a spell? Uh, uh I, it's an item interaction. Oh, yeah, yeah, I'm allowed to use that as the hasted action. That is fair. That is fine. <laughs> Nuke him! Uh, roll. Use Durgus. Use now, the charges. Do I use uh, one of the charges or one of the charges? Your choice. Uh, just, just one. We'll, we'll see just how... Uh, so... We'll, we'll see how I... Uh, oh. 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 Hold on. <laughs> Holding? Waiting? Yeah, so they all have to make dex checks. That is a Fuck. pathetic roll. You all you, know, you, you, you know, rolled that. You know, let me cook. <laughs> Just for you. <laughs> Fail. <laughs> Fail. So these will take both 25. Oh, these, these guys need to make the saves too. Oh, yeah. hey, yeah, we're clipping them. Clipping them. These have. Okay. Okay. Those have pass. Alright. Well, that's half damage. And this bitch ass looking at us. <laughs> Hi, Min. What? And I, and as I do that, I pocket the necklace and I go, You are beyond stupid. <laughs> you wanted me to fight! And I end my turn. You do I'm see fight, him I'm basically what's called, like, after image dodge it, like fucking Dragon Ball. Okay. 
Also, did he did he take the damage or did he? Not? Oh, he shit! He didn't. He has evasion. <laughs> oh, he. <laughs> well, at least we figured that out. He's a monk or a rogue. Twenty-five, sixteen. Nice hit. Uh, Otash, you're not here, Giuseppe. Yes. Uh, so, question about my bag of illusionary bugs. Mm -hmm. Does it take an action to throw them and then an action to command them? To I, hope I, I hope I hope I to this. command. Because you, that's what it seems like it says, but... An illusionary, it's an action, yeah, it's an attack action, so... Yeah, com commanding them is, uh... It's your head, actually. That's not what's called specify, so it's like, you know, your thoughts, yourself. You don't have to do an action. Oh, it says use an action to command it to move. Yeah, it does. So, it's an action to throw them out and then an action to command them. Yep. It's more of a utility item <laughs> rather than attack one. The other one, what's delusional your... parasit parasitosis, is the more damage, like the more what's called combat one. Okay, I don't think that'd work on a robot. It wouldn't. <laughs> yeah. there's, there's no more subjugators, right? Nope. Hmm. Cool. Okay, I'll just. Well, first of all, I'll marshal check this guy. Which one? The, the, the big guy. Big the guy. Mecha, big guy. Mecha 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 Mecha. You already learned everything, so. Little guy. You can learn his languages, little. which is just draconic. Its stats are Strength 19, Con 19, Intelligence 3. Why well, is just barely sapient? Very dumb. <laughs> Which is why it went for your animals instead of, you know, actual people. Wait, can they take psychic damage or no? Yes. It, uh, immune to it. Oh. Okay. Definitely. So nothing near me can? Nothing near you can. Unless like, Dell or some shit. Uh... Do it. No, no, hit the Phoenician Infernal. Oh my no. god. No. <laughs> He's helping your ass. I don't I guess know who people are. Well, like... well how, how can he tell it's from, uh, Giuseppe? That is so fair. He would finger gun, though. Yeah. <laughs> oh, you <laughs> what? <laughs> Josephy, you're gonna give yourself away. What, uh, what the fuck are you doing to the gun? <laughs> <laughs> okay, I don't know. I should probably just Eldritch Blast, but I kind of wanna... Like, be goofy. I don't you know. haven't attacked once. I think yeah. you're doing pretty good. <laughs> yeah, no, you're very fire. Yeah, you're good support right now. I think you're fine. You could be doing great support. You could, okay. you could, you could just obliterate the Mechamira. Or you could, uh, you could obliterate. You could silvery barbs. I could, I could use a. Use your sneak attack. No, no, no. Wait, is it silvery wind that gives me a health, uh, a hit die roll? I don't, I don't know. even have that. You have sneak attack though, so you can attack it and potentially kill it. Oh, eh, you know what? Sure, sure. Charge in, fucking. Uh, I don't yeah. know how you roll player attacks, honestly. Giuseppe's weird. Oh, he's oh. like, heck, hold on, I'll check the list of attack names. Roll sneak attack first. Okay, uh, wait, okay. Damn. Okay, you know what? Yes! It's 14. <laughs> oh, he won. Okay, he like, hold on, heck, I have to check the names that I have. Uh, okay, yeah. He like, stabs into it, cutting apart its limbs, and he says, Midnight Blue, amputation. And then it falls <laughs> to the ground. You amputate its HUD. <laughs> Very good. Nice work. Nice work. Nice work. I, I think cool. that's good. called decapitation. Nah, nah. It's amputating, but you know. He's a doctor, the so amputation. Oh, okay. Uh, Tolko, like, sees the guy in the distance, and he's just like... Get the twink. He, he just, he, he kind of just looks, <laughs> and he's like... That's probably bad news. Uh, let's take care of this before he's I give up. He's definitely like, he looks abnormal. Like, he looks abnormal. Like, for, you know, quote unquote random ass guy in the fucking middle of the beach. He looks like in the middle of a battlefield. Yeah, yeah so uh, like, Toko has been enough battles. So he's just like, yeah, nothing is going to come out of this guy. Let, let's just he's, take care of him. He's he's the gear maker, guys. And uh, yeah. as such, uh, Toko is going to snipe this dude from across the map with Chaos Ball. Nice. How much range does it? 120 feet. Nice All right. Let's see if you hit. And uh, it's going to be cast a second and level. Got it. Nice. Hey! Oh, <laughs> okay, so... Yeah, that, if it's second level... Yeah, uh, so let's see. That is... 
two D eight well, plus roll. yeah. Uh, the damage. Gotta roll the, the, yeah, the damage, the damage type, yeah. type first. Uh, this will be cold, uh, but I can yeah, use a sorcery uh, point roll, to change roll, that <laughs> into roll something. Another D8. Yeah. Uh, you go. Another D8. Oh! Okay. So, 10 damage. And then cool. roll, you're changing it to what? Uh, I... If I change to thunder, I could go for it again. No? I don't I... think that, I don't think you uh... forcing it to change allows it to do it again. I, I think it only works when you roll 2d8s of the same number. Okay. Oh yeah, yeah. Only two D's um, of the same. Uh, so, let's uh, see. You you have a you have a choice between cold and thunder. Okay. Uh. Hmm. Also, the additional D four cold. Uh. That's no, cold. that that's already gone. Oh, never. Two D sixes. Yeah. Uh. In this case, hmm. Which one do I think will hit hurt this guy most? Hmm. Probably mm. thunder. <laughs> I mean, I can change it between and uh, yeah, hmm, yeah, sure. We're him with thunder. <laughs> Got it. And uh, so we'll, now we'll for two d six. Yep. Uh, two d. Uh, wait. What do you mean two d six? Uh, forty six. Forty six. Got crit. Oh yeah. Sorry. Oh. And it was at second level too. So also, yeah. also two more d eights. Oh boy. Tell me what the total damage is, I'm gonna be lost. Yeah, yeah two, okay, two, so two, 4 d8 plus... No, just, we, we count the 2 and the 8 that, that's already been rolled. We count that as damage too. So roll 2d8 and 4d6. Because there's a potential, if you roll the same number, you can just fucking <laughs> leap it onto another person. Yeah, so do this. Okay, 20, 30, 21 plus... 31. 31 damage. 31, 31 thunder damage. Got it. Hot damn. Okay, he has a lot of temp HP. <laughs> oh fuck. Okay, we're going in. Now. Oh. Uh, and then we shall Marshall check this dude. Oh. <laughs> can we call for Otash? <laughs> you can. I'll let you start. What's called? You can have Emily cry. Otash, <laughs> I don't know your name. <laughs> Are you good now, though? What's called? Big man, big soon. man. Okay. Marshall check when you want to learn. Uh, I want to know this his weaknesses. His weaknesses for Wendell? Yeah. This uh, mysterious man. He has one vulnerability. Wendell, high man. <laughs> and one it one is. Oh it's my cold. god, it's a god. 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 Oh, are you kidding me? That's so uh, funny. We Alright, well, well uh, freeze him. <laughs> freeze him, boys. <laughs> freeze his ass. Uh, He's, a He's a traitor. <gasps> oh! <laughs> Oh, that is a possibility. Yeah, yeah, actually, yeah, that would make sense. That's cool. <gasps> Hana's like that too. <gasps> yeah, that wait, wait, wait. We guessed he was a rogue because we thought he we thought he evasioned our, the necklace of fireballs, um, but he could just be straight immune to the fire damage. Just <laughs> oh, no. Continue. Are you good? Uh, hmm. Let's see. E. I use my spell slot. I. Okay, so here, I'll use, I think, I'll use a few spell slots to create some more, uh, points. You're really getting a lot of spell slots. I, yeah, yeah. Well, that, uh, yeah, I'll use some spell slots to create some more sorcery points. Let's see how many, though. He's literally just a fucking gun. He, got, he keeps shooting people. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so let's see. Uh, that's creating spell slots. We need the opposite. Okay, so, okay, got it. I'll use two of my first level spell slots to create two sorcery points. Got it. Anything else, like, that I have to worry about? Uh, I don't think I can cast any more spells after that, yeah, can I? cannot. Yeah, so... I'm if you want to move or not. Uh, I'm at pretty good distance, so I'll just keep sniping. Okay. Uh, Infernal will run up here and... Get obliterate on Dash. He can't reach it, so no. Come Dang. Back, no. Your turn, though. Do you want to call for help? Do, 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 do. Okay, uh, the fuck. Uh, I did not mean to do that. Okay, um, yeah, I guess that would be telling all like, Hey, uh, Tash, we need some help. Oh, no. There, there's there's a guy with blonde hair over there. And one of our teammates ran in. It's a good thing. There's a guy with blonde hair and blue eyes. It's about to get really offensive in here. Oh no! <laughs> it's a hot twink. We need help. <laughs> All right. Anything else? Uh, oh, okay. wait. Are we um, shipping Dell and Wendell? 
What? No. I'm down for that. That's funny. No. Enemies to lovers. <laughs> a, a trope. Okay, uh, that is time wonderful. for extra saucy shit. I have been waiting so long. Bonus action. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> oh my god, you're actually going for it. <laughs> I'm going for it. <laughs> All right, hey, uh, wait, I grab wait. out. I grab out Greasy. I'm gonna fucking <laughs> tighten the bandana on my head and start swinging my, my glaive around. <laughs> Let's do oh, this shit. Oh no! I'm doing it. <laughs> Let's fucking do it. <laughs> no, I'm using oh, inspiration. Oh, we're, we're blessed. <laughs> Let's get higher. Bless, bless, bless. Hey, much bless. better. Getting higher. Wait, All right, wait. we're gonna we're gonna fucking crit. Uh, not even crit that. Uh, I, we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna. Uh, I got, a, I got okay. a question. Does a does a 15 hit? It hits, what's it called, whatever, whatever 26, like, key roll 26, so everything here is going to be, let's go, contesting 26, basically. Oh, okay. So, okay, 7 and... plus 9 is 16. 16 damage total. What the fuck? Fuck yeah, baby. Fuck yeah, fuck yeah. Fuck 16. Good. Wrong one. 16. <laughs> you fucking slice the heads off of these things. Nice. Good work. And then I'm, 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 I'm Marshall checking this bitch. Uh, yeah. Well, I don't want to learn. DC is fifteen. Oh, you bitch. Okay. Uh, uh, I guess immunities. <laughs> immunities. That's funny. Lightning. <laughs> oh wait, what? He wasn't immune to fire. He's wait, not. he just has an actual evasion. It seems now. Oh, he's like okay. That. He's he's just that guy. He is that guy. Okay, and that's my turn. All right, Thurgis, what do you want to do? Uh. Oh, let, let's start off with this. Healing. Oh, come on. Man, roll the one. It's so sad. Uh, I will just hang right here and swing twice at this guy. Got it. And we're going to play this safe. Nice. Uh, nice. Bless, bless, bless. Uh, bless. The hits. <laughs> we're in, we're in. Oh my god. In. 17 and 16. We're in. 21 damage and he has a uh, unwavering mark on him. Nice. We're in. We're in. Anything else? Uh. Drink I'm, a going to, I'm gonna marshal check Wendell. Go for it. Never mind. Nope. <laughs> Alright. Attack the Phoenician. One, two. Yes! Attack the V. One, two. Uh, no! Attack Durgus! One, two. Double no! Uh, no. I, I I'm will down. use my reaction to swap places with him for the crit and take the 13 damage. <laughs> nice. Do your own damages, by the way, because we're going to do the Phoenicians. I also have to plan something. Okay. So you Phoenician. only get 9, and I will take the 13. 21. Fill up! Oh, uh, we swap places. Mm, this is a much more precarious position. Well, it's better than you going down. Uh, this is true. <laughs> it's prolonging the inevitable because of Thurman's attack. You that one is initiative. That's pretty funny. They have <laughs> plus nine? You'll find out soon enough. Yeah. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so he talks. He sees, like, Zell just cleave off most of his soldiers. He's like, <clears throat> let me get my voice mod up. Uh, oh, fuck. no. <clears throat> You're not a Phoenician. What the fuck are you doing? What the fuck are you doing? <laughs> what the fuck are you doing? Fucking killing my <laughs> man, killing my robots. Listen, they attacked us first. <laughs> well, you're. They only attack you if you're helping Phoenicians. Dirty fucking Phoenicians, too. Like, I have one behind you. Alright, and then that's six seconds. <laughs> and talking got is it. a free action. Talking is a free action. <laughs> Yeah, but you got six right. seconds. Fuck you. Back to Emelyn. And then, oh, uh, I, I, I gotta go. I, oh, we can stop here really, if you want. Yeah, I'd prefer to stop here. Let's stop here then. Seems <laughs> good. Okay. Uh, oh, hey, we're at top of the initiative, so we don't have to mm. God, do anything. Yeah. Good. Thank you guys for playing. Have a good no problem. It was really well, good night. Thank you so much, Kirby. We'll, we'll beat some answers oh. out of uh, Wendell here. I finally was able to do it, Kirby. I was finally able. Holy shit. Oh, my. <laughs> Finally, it took Bye. you long enough. Yeah, because nothing was set up and everyone was getting in the way. <laughs> yeah.
I, 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 Runeblade, you I set it up for you. <laughs> You'd get in the way! <laughs> I was not in the way. Oh, I can't wait. I'm gonna get <laughs> my guy, ass beat. This guy's funny. <laughs> Oh no. He sounds like he's the voice mod makes him sound underwater. Yeah. <clears throat> oh, who else is here? Oh, miners here. I want to see how it's called. Oh, <laughs> well, wait. Miners here? Yeah. Oh, Miner, disturbing. Miner, how are you? How's how's Europe? How many churches have you visited? Oh no, Kirby this <laughs> Is this the Hana 3.0? No. <laughs> Don't say 